Hello. Whoa. Fast. Fast to super slow. Wow. What's up, everyone? Hello. Hi, hi. JT first in chat. Amazing. My comic. I was about to hit s come say hi, and then I realized I didn't have my glasses and I couldn't find them, and now I realize they're really dirty. Um. Yeah. How is everyone? JT, hi, welcome in. Shannis, hi. Cars, what is up? Look at all those beautiful daily brain cells y'all are finding. Has anyone lost their brain cells yet? Has anyone lost them? I don't think so. I feel like I would have known. I'll lower my music a little too, hold on. Music volume good, or is it too loud or too quiet? Geo, what's up? Welcome in. Who else we got? Did I see Sammy in there? Yo, it's Friday, Sammy. Is it your birthday yesterday or is that today? Happy birthday, though, to Friday, Sammy. Shout out for you as well. Let's see if we get another goat horn. No, that's that one. You don't think you've heard that one yet? Yeah, I love the goat horns. They're so good. Hi. Not yet. Knock on wood. Oh my gosh. Birthday yesterday. Let's go. So, let me go in my game so it's not frozen. Okay, cool. Not like there's much movement anyway right now. Um, so I got this. LaCroix. So I had one, like, half, not even halfway finished, drinking it, halfway empty. Um, but I wanted a really cold one, and so I could do this um, for you. Uh, so there you go. I put the other one back in the fridge. Don't worry. I didn't waste it. <laughs> how was, how was the... Can opening ASMR was it good? Give me a rating on like one to ten, zero to ten. You could even do a zero if you really didn't like it. Like, was it good quality? Eleven. Okay, eight point five. Ao. Drink, bitch. Who? I only have water and sparkling water, but it's all good. We're still a drink, bitch. <laughs> I'm the sparkling water propagandist, as you should be. Glad you love it. Does anyone else have any fun drinks? Anyone else literally have LaCroix right now? Is that how you say it? I hear people always say that. Where are all the endies? There's only two down there, you see that? They're down there. It's not spawn proof yet, so they're down there. There's zero now. I think they're just out of range. I don't know. Actually, no, they they fit down there. I was going to say, maybe the glass is too close to the ground. They're down there. No, there's, there's plenty of space for them. You have a Coke? Amazing. Five, because I have beef with LaCroix. Oh, do you? Like, a personal beef, or are they, like, bad? Are they awful humans? If so, I did not know that. Can with sparkling water flavored is fine, but plain. 
like plain sparkling water. I actually like it. It's water, but spicy. Exactly, it is spicy. This remix is too much. Personal beef because they don't have an, enough essence in them. That's so fair. Does anyone have a um, soda stream? I have one. I need to get a new... I haven't used it in like over a year. But I like just making plain sparkling water with that. Extra spice too. Like make it super duper bubbly till it burns. It's actually... I never... I actually never used the soda flavor, JT. I only ever made um, just plain sparkling water with it actually. I love that it's your thing. Show off what you have and how it sounds. Yeah. Absolutely. Think about carbonation. Ah, yeah, that that's so fair, Gio. It burns. Amazing. I never had spicy water. Ooh. I mean, Coke's, Coke's kind of like spicy water. All right, so I'm gonna try to finish this platform today. And for those of you that are not on Twitter, Twitter, Twatter, I almost said Twatter, Twatter. For those, because we're talking about water, water. This is the screenshot I took for for my glowing live tweet. Me just diving straight down at the island like this, not scary at all. That's what it, that's what it, it was kind of scary making that picture. Clickbait legend, yeah. It probably doesn't look as scary as it does actually doing it. That nope. JT, there are the Endermen. You decide to fly up into the to the sky, and there they are. There's so many just spawned from that. I don't like the taste of sparkling water, but I drink it when I crave the bubbly sensation. No particular flavor soda. Yeah, gotcha. That's so fair. Shawnees. The friends, they're back. JT, so when they're not- when they're no longer living on this island, we're gonna be building- I don't know if you've heard this already or not. I've been talking about it, but we're gonna be building them a mansion on a nearby island so they can be free from the Ender Dragon. We're gonna build a giant mansion out of all the blocks we mine from this island. Probably not all two and a half million, but we'll build something. Okay, yeah, so we're gonna finish covering it in glass today. I I got more glass off stream. Actually, Tekken got more glass off stream. I would shout her out if she streamed, but shout out to Tekken. I got some of it. I had two shulker boxes. But she got like a couple more. Five five more. Freaking wild. I le I left the boxes in the basement because I was like I was going to go back and get it, and then I came back on and they were just like filled up. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> friends, so many friends. They can watch them and they don't try to kill you through the glass. I know. True besties like this. Yeah, so this, we're going to finish this. All the black, it'll be black by the end of stream today. Completely. <laughs> Hashtag essence. Essence. Off-camera mining, oh my gosh. That's for sure. I get time because it's... Oh, lime, because it's most tolerable. My favorite brand is actually something cheap at Aldi's. It's so much essence. <laughs> ah, that's amazing. I love that for you. It's always nice to, like, have a thing, you know, that you like. Why my brain look at the map and go, Australia? It's whatever the ink blot tells you. I've been saying that, like, when this is done, it's just gonna look like an ink blot. And you'll see whatever your brain sees, you know? Free therapy. This is the original island. Preserved. The map is preserved. It's locked. And will stay like that. <laughs> Zam, free therapy! Your husband is a psychology teacher? I didn't know that. That's cool. It's glass time. 
Okay, so we got more glass. Black glass. Did I die? I died all- I died six boxes worth? I have two extra boxes. So... This is... I'm just gonna dive right into it while the song is popping off. So we're gonna be placing glass. Okay, so any ideas for the mansion? I don't really know. We're gonna build- I have a few ideas. One is it's going to be built out of the blocks we mine from this island. We can make it also into, like, endstone bricks to get a little fancy. Endstone bricks and, um... What else? Endstone bricks. And then what I was thinking, since they're always going to the overworld to collect the blocks, like grass and cacti and whatever they collect, what else do they collect? Uh, sand blocks, and we'll get blocks for them from there, and we'll use those to also decorate the mansion. Like, the property. So whatever blocks that Enderman can collect, we'll bring them all to them, because they like them. So that's what we're gonna do. That's the idea. And it's gonna be really, really big, like, obnoxiously big. I want to use all the blocks, but I don't think that's possible. Like, from this island. Like, completely move it, you know? Like, we're doing the grand Enderman gesture by, like, moving the blocks around, but at a lar at this scale. You know? So they can have blocks! Exactly! Isn't that- I think that's a cute idea. We love the Enderman, so... This is all supposed to get filled, right? My mouse sensitivity is too high. There we go. That's better. Do I have to fill this? Yeah, I do. I just... I made a bridge up to the... A ladder up to the... Gateways. That are temporary. For now. So, so if someone actually had to go up there, they could. I just completely got rid of the stairs previously. Australia. Oh, what do the lamps under your webcam mean? They are my follower goal. Occasionally, it'll go across and say, like, follower goal. That's the follower goal. How many are lit up is how close we are. Yeah. It's a load bar. Yeah, it fills- it lights up as it goes. The current light that's like fully lit, it wasn't fully lit when I started streaming again. So now it's fully lit, and I think that's really epic poggers of the follows and the lights lighting up. Yeah, it's a load bar. It goes by every like two minutes, I think. I didn't want to have the text constantly there. Because I, like, had it there, and I'm like, I don't know if I want the text always there. You know? Your therapy is not always great. That is true, Geo. We will not say that the, the free therapy is great. I definitely... Yep. <laughs> it's just an ink blot. You may learn something about yourself by looking at it. Will it help you? I don't know. Probably not. As someone who's been in therapy for a while and goes all the time. Uh, we are blocked. It's We'll definitely finish it this time. Last stream I did this, that I was like, will we have enough glass? Will we have enough glass? We didn't have enough glass, not even close. But this time I actually have enough, though. So that's, that's amazing. I think. If I don't have enough, I'm gonna be really upset. Really, really upset. So, so upset. Just kidding, I don't really care. But I think we'll finish it. Do you have that through service, the low bar, and the shadow rams? I made all of it. 
Um, well, like, I'm using Mix It Up Bot to, like, make it happen. The... The... The RAM with the shoutouts, um... Is basically just the... A, a PNG of a goat from the Minecraft wiki. And then, uh, it's like a... It's essentially just like a, um... Transition effect. Where it zooms in to the right and zooms out to the right. Zooms in from the left and zooms out to the right. So it's just like a, um... Transition. That it loads in. And a bunch of other, like, steps in the command. It's like a long command of steps. It, like, does the text, does the sound, picks a random sound, actually. So I have a list of all the sounds that it can use, and then it picks a random one from the list. Yeah. Yeah, mix it up. You can do a lot with mix it up bot. It's a little hard to look at when you first get it, but it it's not, it's not that hard to look at. It's just, like, it's pretty bare bones, but it can do a lot, which is amazing. It's definitely more to look at than, like, Nightbot or something, because it actually has an interface. It's not all just through the command line. Um, and the... I want to make sure I don't miss any chats. I think I didn't miss any chats, yeah. <laughs> I did miss that one about Soda rebelling in Geo's stomach, but... I understand that. <laughs> I did miss that one. Um, let's see. What else? You asked about the load bar. The load bar is a little more me. Like, I had to... I essentially made the two graphics in Illustrator or in Photoshop or something, or in Illustrator. You can make it... I, they're essentially just a block texture for the redstone lamp on and off, and I made a little bar with all of them, and then they're overlapped, and then it's a little bit of, like, um, coding to, like, grab the progress number and then, uh, show how much is there based on that. So I had to do a little, um, little coding to get it to show the progress. Because Mix It Up doesn't have progress based on images. Like, it, Mix It Up can do a goal bar, but it goes based on, like, two colors, basically. So I had to, like, do a little, um... Do you know HTML or another coding? Uh, it was the, the bar is mostly, like, CSS, which goes with HTML hand-in-hand. -hand. There's just, like, a little CSS. I know a little bit of, like, Java script, not too much, and a little bit of. I haven't. I don't really like use it regularly, so I forget a lot of it. What else? I know a little bit of like um, jQuery too, which is built jQuery, which I really like. But it's like basically a built on Java, so it's basically just like a. Uh, like, pre-built Java thing, which is really nice. You're so <laughs> I can find what I need inside of already made code, but I can't write it myself. I usually do stuff like that. I think a lot of coders do that, to be honest. Like, you can pick stuff out of code and then, like, rework it. That's usually what I do. I don't really, like, write stuff. I always have to, like, look stuff up and, like, make it work. Like, I know some of it, but, like, I usually have to, like, look at stuff. I can't just, like, sit there and, like, program like a maniac like they show in TV shows or movies where people are just like, No, I can't do that. That's also not real. <laughs> also not real, <laughs> but... <laughs> Coding's fun. So you can look at code. That's that's pretty cool though. Do you like it? Are you interested in it? Ow. Is this corner done? Did we do it? Do we do it, chat? I think we did it.
Oh. Do we do it? Do we do it? Do we do it? Yo, that corner is done. Does it still remind you of Australia? Okay. Sip of LaCroix. Dad is a computer teacher, like web design, animation, drafting, programming. So when I need help, I just ask. Oh, that's cool. Do you have to like do? Do you have to do it for your like job sometimes or something? Why do I feel like I remember you talking about that? Is that true? That's how I learn everything. I always just like pick stuff apart and then like remake it. Alright, so let's do top left, top left or right section. Let's do the top. Let's do that one. Yeah, let's do that. Any other coders in the chat? Anyone like, anyone do coding? I love like programming and coding stuff. Like it's so fun. I love like figuring it out and then when it works, it's like so cool. Like the, like the loading bar at the bottom. I'm like so happy I was able to like figure that out. Oh yeah, so what I was saying, like, the bar at the bottom, like, makes it a bot can do goals based on, like, you can pick the colors and stuff and set the numbers and whatever, but you can't do it based on images, so I had to, like, program that one to, like, show the image a certain amount, essentially crop it, essentially, like, crops the image, or uncrops it as it goes. It works really well. I'm really happy. Has it showed the thing? I think. Oh yeah, there it goes. There it says the follower goal now. Follower goal. Five ninety four six six six. Okay. Update the website. That's right. You do do the website. I thought so. Mostly drag and drop website. I can access the HTML. Yeah, cool. Sometimes I go in and nitpick. I love that. So fun. Love the tinker. We can try going left-handed. Let's try it. I actually want, like, the <gasps> toffee with a brain cell. Congrats, bestie. That's so hype. I'm gonna listen to my stream playlist. For... I haven't listened to this in a while. I need something a little more hype. There's too much um, Animal Crossing on there. A single brain cell. Let's go. And thank you for the lurk. I appreciate you so much. Let's hit my toffee button. Do 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 Single phrase. <laughs> Never redeem it again. Never redeem it again. It's okay though, if you redeem it multiple times. You have a chance of losing them all, so you can feel revalidated by that if you if you need just lose them all by accident. It's a very low chance to lose them, but it's only a one percent chance. It's good to see you though, Toffee. I got so confused when I was watching your stream yesterday. I'm like. I thought it was Sunday, and I thought it was like a casual Sunday evening stream, but it was not. It was Monday. It was Monday. But lurk if you have to. <laughs> Don't let me keep you. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, what's Toffee on a Sunday evening? Let's go. I'm used to claiming that when I'm standing on the, ch or like popping in the chat when I'm on the train platform going home from work, you know?
one percent for the day or one percent of all the times for one person uh it's for the specific person to lose all of them but besides one so it's a one percent chance each time you claim it so every day you claim the brain cell every stream you claim the brain cell there's a one percent chance you'll lose them all yeah it doesn't accumulate though it's just always a one percent chance gotta keep the keep on gotta keep the people on their toes absolutely it's not me though that's how that's like how brains work you know that's the science of brains sometimes the brain cell cells just go poof you gotta deal with it I didn't design that system your taxi speaking of trains <laughs> Speaking of trains, being on the train platform, today, I had to go into the city for work, and I took the train in, and then I was going back, and I had to go back to work, but I was, like, going away, and I got on the wrong train, to the wrong place. One train goes this way, and one train goes that way, and I'm supposed to go on the one that goes this way, and I went that way. And it was express. So I had to stay on it the whole time until it got to the destination. So I had to sit on there for a half an hour till, till I could get off again. In the wrong place. I was like, and I realized right after the doors closed too, I'm like, fuck. Welp. And then I had to take a taxi because I was nowhere near like being able to get back across to where I need to get. So I had to take a taxi to get where I was supposed to be going, and then I was in the taxi, and I was just like, I need something to, like, keep me calm. And, like, I can't really read or watch things in the car. I get, I get, um, I get, uh, car sick really easily from, like, if I read text or something, or, like, watch something. Um, so I found there's a streamer that I watch that does marbles on stream. So I just started playing marbles while I was in the car. It really helped. It was great. It was such a vibe. I felt amazing. It was just exclamation point play. Exclamation point play. Any marbles people in the chat? Anyone like in the chat like playing marbles on stream? Did Amy lose her brain cells? <laughs> it's because it's the first one. Never redeemed it before. <laughs> There's always a time that you start collecting the brain cells. I've never heard of that. Marbles on stream? It's essentially like, um... It's like a big, like, racetrack, essentially, where you drop... Where, like, all these marbles get dropped into it. And you get to claim them. So you essentially put a marble on the track... So each person in the chat puts a marble in, and then they all, like, roll down the track and try to get to the end and, like, go through the obstacle course. And then it's all, like, random. And then, um, yeah, whoever gets to the end first wins. It's great. You just type exclamation point play. It's awesome. I love marbles. I didn't think I would, but there's a few people that I watch... The few streamers that I watch that do play it sometimes. So, yeah. It is fun. It, it's way more fun than it even sounds or looks. Like, once you actually do it for the first time, you're like, this is so fun. I love it. You just sit there and watch. It's great. It's such a vibe. Yeah, Amy didn't lose, lose her brain cells. Just the first one. I started talking about the, the f losing the brain cells because, you know, having one and feeling it, it being accurate to have one brain cell it's possible to be there again someday. Doesn't even use channel points? Marbles? No. No. So it's like a whole game, um... I think... I don't know if it's a Twitch-only game. I think you probably play it in other... 
platforms too. I'm not sure though. It's on Steam, I think. I, d I never actually download it because I just play in people's streams. Um. Yeah, no channel points. <laughs> Yet. Oh my gosh. So we're finishing this uh, platform of glass, if anyone's wondering. Um, this platform of glass is the future stage that we'll encounter the Ender Dragon on during the epic event that is the Ender Dragon fight. Um, and it's a glass platform that's the same exact shape as the End Island. So it's a flattened version of it where it's just a singular layer of glass. Same shape. And then all this island below will eventually go away. Goodbye. And it'll be void below the platform. So that's what we're doing, if anyone's wondering. <laughs> Get to go to the grocery store, I'll be back hopefully. I should be off for at least several hours. I just got started, so... If I see you again, we'll see you. Good luck at the grocery store. If I don't see you, have a great night. Zoom in to the grocery store. Let's go. I went to the grocery store this morning. It's like a... This morning. I went to the grocery store this weekend so I could buy this. This was the main reason I went to the grocery store. To buy... LaCroix. Main reason. And eggs so I can make brownies. <laughs> That's the, the other main reason. I keep going this way because, like, it's easier for me to click on the right side of myself than the left. Um, Minecraft update soon. They announced the date. I think I talked about this already, but they announced the date for the Minecraft update. Which is June 7th. That's pretty hype. Anyone excited for cherry blossoms? I'm actually excited for the bamboo wood. I'm most excited for that. I keep forgetting about it and then I remember it exists and I'm very excited. Do any fave flavors? Spice flavor of spicy water? Oh my god, donuts. Like how this just uh, um at toffinated. I want donuts. <laughs> it's toffee to get you. Are you donut buddies? Like, do you go to get donuts together? <laughs> Is there a donut backstory? I'm in need. Oh my god. <laughs> Gemini season, it's like the early B-Day gift. Ooh. We're supposed to get go to get a donut place you found near me. It was delicious. Ooh. Yo. That sounds so good. Please send. Probably would not be as good if sent. I lost one glass. Right there. Uh, don't look. I lost this one glass. Will that be the one glass that I'm short? I made that joke last time I was doing this, but I was not even close to it being one glass short. I was not even close to finishing. That would be so tragic. Place in the glass. Place in the glass. Let's go. We are popping off. We're actually doing really good. Very little mistakes. Oh god. Very little mistakes and then one... Then I look at one. Oh 
Come on, come up here. Oh, fuck. I missed. Oh my gosh. Come on. You faked me out. Okay, there we go. Kind of scary. They kind of hurt. I'm so impressed with your patience for building. The yeah. There's sort of pa I mean, there's patience in the fact that I'm still doing it. I'm persisting. But it does kind of hurt my brain. <laughs> I did actually, I did some calculations this weekend of how long it would take to mine the whole island. And it's a really long time. Like, I, I, I like, um, did some, like, mining and timed it and then, like, kind of went based off of my guess. My guess, I'm still guessing around two and a half million blocks for this whole thing. And I think I estimated it to be around 180 hours of work. So, uh, yeah. Well, we already spent a few hours mining. So we have some problem solving to do to get that number down, because there's no way I'm going to spend 187 hours on this. On deleting, to, on mining out the blocks. Come down for pride. Oh my gosh. We get donut and Korean corn dogs and boba. Can the inner dragon destroy glass? No, actually. She cannot destroy the glass. So I did some, like, experimenting with that because that was a concern, Toffee. Um, so the ender dragon only destroys, destroys blocks that it flies into. So if we built a glass tower in the middle of this area and she'd fly into it, it would delete the blocks. It doesn't even break them, it just deletes them as she flies through. Everything besides obsidian and endstone? I think it's like so her flight path doesn't get interrupted. And then... And she doesn't fly below the level of the portal. So she doesn't fly lower than that. Um, and then the the fireballs she shoots does not do any block damage or anything. They don't. They're not like explosive. And then the um, to summon the dragon, you put end crystals around the portal, and those explode. But end crystals are really interesting. They're not like TNT where it explodes everywhere. End crystals only explode horizontal and upward. They do not explode downward. So even putting them right next to the glass doesn't break it, which is very interesting. I didn't know that. Uh. Oh, no, I just didn't answer it yet. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the sound of angry endies is gives me sharp tingles from. <laughs> oh, my God. They are scary. They can really fuck you up, too. They're really, they hurt bad, but they, you know, valid, <laughs> I guess. I actually think I've never seen the Ender Dragon. Interesting. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta see a Toffee Ender Dragon fight. Speed run time. When's Toffee doing a speed run? <laughs> yeah. Huh. Ah. <laughs> Yeah, that would be tragic if the glass just gets destroyed. I did a lot of research into this before I commenced on it, because I'm like, that would be so bad if it just gets destroyed. And then people fall into the void and die, that would be not good. I would not be like... I'd feel really guilty if that happened. <laughs> I'd feel really bad. Yeah, I would cry too. 
we'd all be crying. Thanks for crying with me if, if something like that happened. Ah. Horizon Void Death. Oh my god, for real. Her name is Jean and is sad that she's the last dragon and has no mate. <laughs> there is truth to it. I don't know where it comes from, but everyone calls, like, people actually call her Jean. Like, it's like a thing. Like, I'll meet all different Minecraft people from all different uh, communities, and they all. Like, there'll be random people that just be, like, calling her Jean. Not everyone calls her Jean, but... It's, like, a thing. <laughs> I don't... I mean, I've heard about them. Actually, I don't know if I've heard about the mate lore, but that makes sense. But she's, like, mean to the... The lore that I find really cool about the Ender Dragon is that with the Endermen, that, like, something about going to the overworld... The Ender Dragon is sending them out there to look for, like, a certain kind of block or something. Like, I don't know if it's, like, to find if life is sustainable out there or what. And that's why they pick up blocks and carry them around, because the Ender Dragon send them out there to look for blocks. But I don't really know... So, like, she's kind of mean to them, like, kind of controlling and, like... Um, also, like, kills them during the, the, during the fight. She literally kills them all the time during the fight. It's kind of awful. So we're actually... Part of this project, too, is this island will be spawn-proofed. So no more Endermen will live here. And we're going to build a mansion on an outer island where they're safe from the Ender Dragon. We're going to build them a big mansion and they can just all migrate there and be safe. No, we're getting killed by the Ender Dragon. So that's, like, part of the lore of this project. Free the Endermen of her reign. It'll be really bizarre doing this fight without Endermen, actually, because it's always, like, a big part of the fight, like, to look at them. Or you'll die. <laughs> It's like the easiest way to die on the fight. It's by looking at Enderman. Interesting, yeah. The popular theory makes a lot of sense in the theory videos. Yeah. I gotta watch more theory videos. I find them really interesting. It's really cool. And it makes sense. Like, there is lore. Like, in there, a lot of it's left to, to interpretation. There's still snow down there. So, for who, those who have not seen this part of the um, this project, the first thing we had to do with this project was clear the snow off the island. Because there's a bunch of snow golems out here. They were spawned for, like... Um, a farm that was here and there's a ton of free snow golems and they were wandering the island and they covered like 60 to 70 percent of the island in snow so i i wanted to make a good map of it first before we do anything so i had to <laughs> clear all the snow first so the first stream of like doing this was literally a snow shoveling stream but there's still snow down there that's kind of funny I didn't need to get rid of that because it wasn't on the map, but lo and behold, remnants. Yeah, the lore is, is all the lore is all so interesting. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Congrats on the first rain cell. Basically, the ancient builders are literally... And thank you for the lurk. They kind of mess up. 
ancient builders are literally like humans. They kind of messed up a lot of things for the sake of tech development. They te definitely did good stuff, just went too far. Interesting. Ancient builders as in like the, um, the ender, the, the creatures in the end. So like the enderman and the dragon and stuff or other ancient creatures. Cause I know like the, um, there's some interesting lore with like the piglins and stuff too. So much lore in the game. See, love it. Yeah, there is more. And like, there's a lot going on there. Like even with, with the ancient cities and stuff is so cool. I love the ancient cities and the warden. Like it's there and it, it is very open-ended too, which is awesome. But you can tell they like put a lot of thought into like what it could mean and stuff. And I, and I love that, like, the ancient cities came first, and now they're coming with the, um, the archaeology stuff. It's kind of, like, really interesting that they did that. Someone, yeah, definitely tell they have someone caring about history in there, which is really cool. Like, in their dev team. Um, what's gonna say? Yeah, seemingly simple. It's kind of it's wild. I love it. Oh, I was gonna say there's like a silly lore that's like not really like lore. Um, but like there's like a they don't have a lot of cultural references besides like the you know homages to history, but like the very vague ones. Um, but the, there's like a cultural reference with the, I was talking about to someone about this recently, but like the, with the end, not end mansions, the woodland mansions, um, they're, it's like literally based off of like the shining, the movie. I feel like so much of it is based off of it, and like for sure because like they have the like trick that you can name vindicators Johnny, like here's Johnny, and it turns them against their their um their own kind. So it literally, like makes the vindicators lose their mind and they attack themselves if you name them Johnny. <laughs> so if you hear Johnny them. And, like, the whole concept kind of makes sense. It's, like, kind of like an abandoned big hotel. It's a mansion. It's, like, a, not abandoned, but, like, a closed-down hotel. Which is really bizarre, because, like, they don't have a lot of cultural references. But they have that one. And it's, like, big. It's a big reference. <laughs> it's so strange. I love it, though. It's like someone on the team at the time really just wanted to like really like that movie. Mmm. <laughs> Handy boys were like the main player. Then they went to the end, they evolved over the years and to adapt their gotcha. That makes sense. Pig boy lore. Yeah, I don't know too much about the pig boy lore either. Something with the gold, why they they are so like um like, why they- why it's so valuable to them, and not, like, the rest of the players, because, like, gold is not really that useful in the game, but it's really valuable to the- the piggy boys. So I used two boxes of glass so far. I have four left. Four entire boxes left. That's great. We're doing pretty good, I think. I love that, right? Isn't it so good? How delayed is my chat? <laughs> I think it's so delayed. I feel like it's been so delayed since I came back to streaming. I'm gonna open up... In another window... Pop out chat. I'm gonna open it outside OBS and see how that is. Oh, time to go dive into a Minecraft lore rabbit hole. Amazing. 
We should watch lore videos on stream sometime. I never thought to do anything like that. I don't like, I, ne I would never know what to like watch on stream, but that would be very appropriate. <laughs> that would be very appropriate for my channel, you know? You'd love that? Yeah, that would be fun. We should do that sometime. I don't know when, but... I'll probably, like, plan make it a little more planned so people can, like, um... know to come or whatever, and we can do it. A little special event. Oh, spooky sound. Oh, is this the end of this section? Are we done with this section? Two sections left. I thought this was going to take forever when I started this section, but it's done. That was so fast. Help, where is it? <laughs> so hard to get them off. Oops. It's hard to get them off because I always think the map is smaller than it is. Wait, did I miss one spot there? That one. No way. I missed one block of glass. <laughs> this is a good way to check. Yep, I did. Look, there's one... Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Did I? Oh, yeah, I did. It's so hard to, like, see the map. Because it's, like, so dark in this place. Oh, there we go. I gotta light it up with, with a torch. I know some people have video watch days when they want to stream something kind of chill and no Yeah! So true. Yeah, I like I love doing stuff like that in other people's stream. Yeah, one block. I can't believe that. Holy... Fixed. I love that these map maps are literally one block from... I see in the game chat this. It says CC hit the ground too hard. CC fell from a high place. And I'm like I thought I thought uh, someone was communicating to me in the chat. No, they were just falling. <laughs> I was like, oh, is, is there something going on? <laughs> someone saying something to me. Too funny. Should we do the big section or the small section first? Probably the big section. Because then... All we have is a small section. Let's do the big one. Play the beep stream and see what happens. I'm going to do a slash shout out to CC because just how... I hit CC. <laughs> I just told CC in the chat. I thought someone was communicating to me in the chat. Turns out it just said, hit the ground too hard. <laughs> it's so funny. Oops. Did I look- I looked at an enderman. Fuck. Oh, please don't kill me. Why are you so hard to hit up here? Why does everything feel so slow on the glass? That was weird. Interesting. I don't think she's doing the parkour, right? 
CC finished the parkour. I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Or no. I don't remember. That, that. Maybe she didn't finish it. I forget. This is supposed to be empty, right? Yeah. What am I gonna do after I finish this? I won't be- it won't take that long. I'll probably just mine blocks, I guess. Mine blocks. I don't think I'll do anything else too experimental, because I don't have a lot of energy today. Probably just... mine away. Excuse me. It's kind of hot in my room. I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna put on my air conditioner. Yeah, I'm sitting here like sweating like crazy and I'm like, why is it so hot? Because I started streaming and didn't put on my air conditioner since I got home from work. Computer really heats up my room. Go mining, let's go. Good luck down there.
An emerald. One day I can add trading to Minecraft. Mine chat. Chat Minecraft. Focus. Zoom. I need something different music wise. <laughs> I want like something or like electronic something, but I don't really have a playlist for that. I need like bangers. Um, yeah, I could just try searching. DMCA free. You can try a random one, see if we like it. Playlists. Dope beats. Uh. That is not DMCA free. These are DMCA free. Why doesn't that work? Oh, EDM electronic DMCA free. Forty hours of music. We could try it. If I don't like it, we'll just switch to something else again. Real trading instead of the faux share commands. I was... <laughs> yeah. Real share command would be cool, too. Let's see how this does. I need something to, like, get... Need something with some beats to get me into a rhythm. That's the real feat of any of the- is this a hole? There's a hole. I think- I'm like, how riveting can this really be? Like, is this- th this content must be so, like, whatever. Not that interesting to watch, but I'm actually like- Maybe the most interesting part about is- about any of this is just being able to keep focus and do it. <laughs> actually like stay persistent and complete this that's probably the the most interesting part so i don't know how it, like looking at end stone really is it's like okay enough end stone enough glass nice to listen to the sounds yeah that's true yeah i don't people have mentioned the sounds a couple times that is so true not that i feel bad about any of it because i know it's like it's fun anyway to like hang out and just do it. It's just interesting to think about from a content perspective. <laughs> I really wish I like was recording all of this like with there's a mod the replay mod where you can like b make time lapses from but I'm like honestly that would be so much footage. How would I ever make a time lapse out of that? Like it would be so much. So much. That'd be cool, though. I didn't do it because I'm like, whatever. I'm not going to overthink it. I'm just going to do, do the damn project. And I didn't want to overwhelm myself w with trying to make that video at the end, too. I'd be like, I might lose some sleep over that. We got the VODs to prove it, but... 
Block placing and breaking, yeah. It is satisfying. Oh, I would I would watch something like this in a heartbeat. Okay, I've been on like rave TikTok lately. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up there. I get a lot of music TikTok stuff, which I really like. Like, musicians, like, making stuff. And, like, teaching about it. And I'm like, I've never wanted to go to, like, a rave so bad in my life now. I've seen some, like, really wild shit. I'm like, this is so fucking cool. I want to go. I've never wanted to go. I'm kind of too scared. But I kind of want to go now. <laughs> rave talk. No, for real. I've never been to one, so... Has anyone in chat ever been to a rave? I was always, like, too scared to go to, like, clubs and stuff. It freaked me out. Too many people. I want to go once, just one good time. Yeah. So there's some, like... Are you on TikTok? You're not on TikTok, right, Shunnies? Where are you? No, you're not. There's like one video of this like... There's like these insane visual visuals where there's like... A, the screen has to be like at least 50 feet tall. And like there's like these kind of like illusions that are occurring with these like characters. That like go to the music. It's so cool. I'm like, I need to see this in person. It looks so cool. We all post it in the Discord. I'll post it- I'll post it in the Discord. I'll at you in there so you can see what I'm talking about. Because I think it would be a good time. <laughs> but they don't- like, these kind of things don't exist in the US really, though. I think you would have to go to another country. Like, the thing I'm talking about. Like, I don't think they're really a thing here. I know it's like a big- much bigger thing in Europe. They could exist here, but not like that. So I even looked, like, for this one creator, I'm like, they only exist in fucking... They're all, like, only in Spain. Not always, but, like, the upcoming stuff. I'm like, yeah, I gotta go to Spain, I guess. I'm worried I'd get overstimmied. Yeah. Same. But, like, at this point, like... I personally, like, think I have ways to, like, tools to, like, deal with it and, like, cope with it. So, like, I feel like I could, I could do it now. It's important to, like, know that you'll be able to, like, handle it, I guess. Because I totally would worry about that, too. And I never know what to do with myself, but I realize it's just like, you just have to, you can literally just stand there and maybe even bop a little, but you don't even have to bop a little. You can just literally stand there and no one will give a shit. You just enjoy it, consume it. I just feel like people are going to judge me. Hmm. <laughs> Trauma. Uh, yeah. Friend was a big raver, so I'd go with her. Yeah, see, exactly. If you have someone that can, like... Especially if they'll, like, know about you, like, getting overstimmied. Can maybe just, like, help you. That would be cool. Right, so far I like this playlist. This is solid. This is exactly what I need right now. Gotta go for a bit. Yes. See you later. Thanks for popping in. I'll probably be on for quite a while yet. Ah. I don't think I'll experiment with like the light show. Or anything yet. 
not quite there yet mentally. This is gonna be really satisfied to have this part done. I'm really excited about that. No singing. Okay, this is just like turning. Let's just fill this whole section. Yeah, let's go, let's go straight across. Go back and forth this way. I'll just I'll I'll do the left side. That's fine. I can go on my left. It'll be good to switch it up. Keep me on my toes instead of like getting too much in the rhythm and then messing it up. The thing I had to do also is like build out the platform below the island so it can catch all the all the blocks that fall when we mine it. That's not really that important because I'm not anywhere close to mining down that far. Oh, cool, that section is done. Now let's go. Let's fill in. Yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of the weird bits and then we can go back and forth. Make a nice, even surface to work with.
Beautiful. Now I think it's an even space I gotta fill. So I can just go back and forth. I think I have enough glass for- oh no, I still have the other side to do. I think I have enough glass, though, so this time. So, these are full over here. This is almost empty. Empty. So I have two more full. We used three boxes so far. Totally got this. Can actually just go in a circle around. Gateway just made a purple beam. I always wonder why that actually happens. Like, is it random? Or something happening over there? Is it on a timer? Is it a random timer? They just make a little purple beam. I always thought it was like when someone was going through it, like a teleporting, but it's, it's not it. Don't think there's anyone going through there. I think we're on part three. I put part three in my title today. I think this is my third stream of this. At least building the platform. Doesn't matter, but I thought that was kind of funny. Just like, is it part three? I almost said part two, but that's definitely not true. Definitely not true. Almost time for another LaCroix black raspberry. I'll do it on my break. At, at the two hour mark. Can I wait that long though? That is the question. God, I'm fucking tired. I had a very physically demanding day at work, so I'm like, I feel shot. 
And I went on a hike over the weekend. Like, six miles, I think? It wasn't, like, super duper far, but still a pretty solid, solid hike. In the outdoors. I was wondering why I was, like, itchy all day today, or yesterday. I'm like, why am I itchy? Forgot that I was getting bit by mosquitoes <laughs> over and over again. I'm like, oh yeah, that, that'll do it. That definitely will make you itchy. That explains it. Especially on my hand for some reason. Like, why are they, why are they biting me on my hand? Can you not? Twitter, yeah. I was thinking before, um, I don't really go on Instagram, like, ever. I don't really post on there ever. I kind of want to. It's not like, I don't think it's, like, super active for stream stuff, honestly. But it'd be nice to put... I was thinking I could do, like, a tour of all my builds that I did on Bones SMP over the year. So the last thing I posted on here was like that we were starting Bones SMP a year ago. Think about like going around taking pictures of everything and like making posts for each thing. Maybe I'll do that before the the one year anniversary. It's a lot of work though. Ooh, this is almost done. Spiraling in close. Sick. Map update time. Let's go. Let's freaking go. I gotta fly over there for that one. It's kind of far away. Awesome. This one. Probably gonna fly over to. Out. It's all good. There's like a funny little blue line here because of the water. I could probably put a piece of glass over it, maybe. I mean, it's fine. I, I probably won't do a piece of. Well. Maybe for the final map, I might put glass over it, because once the map, it, the map's not going to be here, so it doesn't need to be, like, updated, so I could just, like, make a copy, and then lock it, and then get rid of the glass. Wait, I missed the spot. 
somewhere over here. Oh yeah, right there. It's funny how that happens. And the map can confirm it for me, which is fantastic. Yo, that looks so good. We did so much already today. I'm gonna drink some water to celebrate. Okay, I just gotta do that section. That's great. I'll, d I'll finish before I even take a break. I wonder if I should just close out the map. Well, I'll leave it for a bit. I'm not gonna be building much up here. Like, put glass over these portals too. And then lock it. I don't know. These towers look so interesting on here. We could also try some crying obsidian or something to line the top of the towers. To make like a little pattern. We'll see. So I have one and like a third of a box left. That's definitely enough. This section is not that big. Okay, so I'm going to do the same thing where I make... Oh, this is going to be hard to make a rectangle. Oh, let's just go like here... And then I can do one on that side. Yeah, this is fine. I was just wondering about my pickaxe, pickaxe durability, but like, I'm not mining. I'm <laughs> policing blocks. It's so silly. My brain be doing mushy things. Oh, oh, it's okay. I am not going to retrieve that. It's fine. Yeah, places to be. Glass place. Okay, so now I think I'll build a bridge out this way. I almost looked right at that Enderman while I was scoping that out.
Let me zoom in. Guys, it's June. Hello, June. Okay, my... I was wondering about my stream delay before, my chat delay. But your chat came into my stream manager at the same time as my OBS, so it's fine. What's up, June? How are you? Good to see you. A little shout out for June. <laughs> What a horn. That was... I always like that one. It's funny. Doing good, thank you. Of course. Glad you're good. You had off tomorrow. I mean, off tomorrow. You had off yesterday, yeah? So you're back to work today. Nice long weekend. Heck yeah. Love a long weekend. Did you do anything fun or just chill? I'm so, I had such a chaotic day back today that involved a lot of traveling and a lot of physical labor. So I am so freaking tired. <laughs> After today, it's so chaotic. Mercer. Murder mystery board game yesterday. Oh, that sounds so fun. I love that for you. Non-stop meetings. Oh, yeah. After the break, everyone's like, we gotta talk. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but yeah. I also got lost today. I didn't get lost on the train. I took the wrong train. And I went the completely wrong direction. And it was express. So I had to just like wait 30 minutes till I could get off again. And I had to take a cab. To get to where I was supposed to go. It was all fine. It worked out fine. And then in the cab I played marbles on stream. It was great. It was, it was perfect. It was a vibe. Yeah, oh no. It was like, whatever, it's kind of frustrating, but I haven't made a mistake like that in a while. But it is what it is. They were just five in here on the last bit of the glass. I only have this one little section left. And then the stage itself is complete, which is amazing. You got where you're going today. Exactly. Exactly. I was kind of stressed because I, like, I had to be home by a certain time and, like, it was fun. Like, I have therapy on Tuesdays. At like 5.15, so I'm like, I had to be home by then. So I had to like, take the call on the train and whatever, but it worked out fine. We did it. We did it. I don't- I used to care about that kind of stuff a lot more, but I don't anymore. I'm just like, it's literally nothing I can do. Play just vibe. Play marbles on stream. Last glass placements, yeah. For real, it's like... It'll be done in no time. I stocked up on glass. And actually, I can't take full credit for that. Because I left a bunch of shulker boxes in tech space because I was, like, filling them. And, um... I, can't, I logged back on, like, the next day and, like, tech logged on apparently and like filled up six shulker boxes of glass I'm like I 
haven't seen seen her on, so I'm like, I'll just leave the boxes. It's fine. Like, leave them there. Because I don't like usually like leaving stuff in people's places, but it's fine. Marbles, anyway. Have you never seen it at all? Or have you, like, seen it and you don't really know what it is, or you've, like, never seen it? <laughs> yeah, for real. Right? I was like, oh my gosh. And she was just like, oh, I figured I'd help. I'm like, well, thanks. Because I had like eight boxes on the floor. Because I'm like, eight boxes should definitely be enough to finish. I think I need like six, but eight to be comfortable. So, like, I filled two of them and she filled the rest. I'm like, oh my god, please. Because it's so, it's like a lot of trading. So I trade for villagers for that. And it's just like, it's kind of annoying. Well, you have to like wait for them to restock and stuff. No, not physical marbles. So marbles on stream. Um, it's a game that you connect to your stream and like people, it's like a track that you put the marbles in. So each player in the chat can put a marble on the track. And then it's like a little like obstacle course kind of thing. And they all like roll down the track to try to get to the end and see who gets to the end first. It's like a little race. And the marbles just roll down the hill until they get there. It's really fun. <laughs> so just like random, you know, like you all start at the same spot and like you all bounce off of each other sometimes and... You can fall off the tr some of the tracks. It is fun. There's a couple streamers I watch that play it. There's one streamer I watch that um, has been streaming every day for like over a thousand days. Streams every day. And he plays Minecraft late at night, but all day does marbles on stream. <laughs> It's wild. For like at least eight hours a day. It's absolutely incredible. But there's a few other people that I watch that like do the occasional marbles on stream. I don't like watch any like marble streamers <laughs> per se, but it's like occasionally they'll do it. Sometimes people have like a regular day, they'll do like marble stay. It's fun. I like it. It's, it's like, even, it's even more fun when you do it. Like, when I first saw it, I'm like, I didn't really, like, understand. And I'm like, yeah, like, that's cool. But it's the first time, so you like to play, you usually type exclamation point play in the chat. The first time I typed exclamation point play, it was exhilarating. It was great. <laughs> that wasn't right. Isn't that amazing? Life goals. The stream every day. Long streak ever was five days? Yeah. I think probably about the same. Maybe maybe seven days once. When Bones SMP. I think I took a week off, right, when it launched. I think I streamed like probably every day that week, but I'm not sure. Thousand sounds impossibly. Yeah, also, I mean, like, it's like. I think he's, like, retired and then just does, like. He does, like, volunteer work. But I think, other than that, like, like once a week or something. But, like, other than that, he just streams. It's great. Yeah, thousand is it's a long. That's a lot. And it's like they're not short either. It's like eight hours of stream. <laughs> oh, to be retired, imagine not going to work, right? That is like I think about that a lot. I'm like, can I just build a tiny house in the middle of the mountains and um not have as much life expenses? And can my student loans be forgiven or gone? And then I don't need as much money and then I can just like move. And then just do streaming or something and just vibe. 
I'm just so over it sometimes. Like, it's fine, but... It's living the dream right there, right? Just... Yeah. Sounds great. Working towards it. <laughs> Not just a dream. A goal. You know? Yeah. It took a month off between your current job and my last job. I played a lot of Stardew, but streamed none of it. Yeah. Like a month off from streaming? Or just like the month off from like, um, from working. Yeah, I remember you had some time off. Oh, it wasn't a month off from stream. You just had a month off. Gotcha. Just from working. Gotcha. That's awesome. Is that like your first month off since like, um, like forever? <laughs> Gosh. Like, anytime I take, like, a week off from work, it's, like, never enough, you know? I also don't take off enough, as I should. But, last week was my last full work week, five-day work week, ever. This, I am now down, now I don't work Fridays anymore. I am permanently four-day week employee so i will have off fridays which is fantastic forever so this week's a three-day work week if you can believe it i mean for now like i think i i did a lot of like maths I'm pretty sure, like, it'll be fine. Like, I can survive with the four-day-a-week paycheck. But... I can put more energy into content creation, which I think will be fun, you know? Like, I think it'll be, like, survivable just fine. And, like, still be able to save, hopefully, a little bit. Eventually, I'll probably have to do something else, but... I'll leave that for the future. I'm gonna vibe like that for a while, you know? A preview to retirement. I love that. Never taken a long holiday since you got out of college. Yeah. Yeah, 40 work week. Yeah. Yeah, so like... I'm very excited for it at this point. I was very upset when it happened because it was not on my decision. Um, which came with a pay cut, which made me very upset. But, you know, there's it's a double, you know, there's two things. It's like, yeah, I'm actually kind of, I kind of did want to go down to four days at some point, like, recently. So I'm like, it's fine. I'll figure it out. Yeah, so saving will be kind of hard, but it should be fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I got the news, like over a month ago like i i tried to argue too to like get a raise during the cut too but they denied it i'm like this is just such crap but the frustrating part too is like it already i mean the 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 part I'm very thankful for, but also frustrating, is that, like, it pays above industry standard already, the job. For, like, the arts industry does not pay. So, like, the fact that I get paid above industry, like, standard, like, makes it really hard for me to, like, leave. 
<laughs> because I can't get a job that like pays enough. So I'm like, it just ends up working out this way. But I found I got the news like a month or two ago, so I've already like processed it. I'm like, give me that four day three day weekend, please. I really, really am excited. More days to edit videos. I've been I wanna try to do that. Should be fun. It'll be a good time. It's the position your old coworker's in. She won't leave because she gets paid more at her Yup. Yeah. Yeah, like long story short, i I don't really talk about my job on stream much. I used to work for, I work in an art collection and the, the owner of said collection passed away like several years ago and the family took it over and I don't like the person in charge. I do not like, I do not get along with her. It's awful. So like, it's just like not the same anymore. Cause I used to really like the person I worked for a lot. Like I, I, he's amazing. I loved him. And he took care of me, like cared about my needs. So yeah, I miss that. But the job is still pretty okay. It's just. The person. <laughs> Which makes it miserable sometimes, but... Yeah. Yeah, Doc Lore. <laughs> I just do, like, archiving stuff. It's, it's good. It's a cool job. Kind of a unique one, but... I also think my- pretty sure my boss was autistic, too. <laughs> I'm like, I think it makes sense with the collecting and stuff. He just seemed like he was not neurotypical. Is that raging, I see? Yo, it's raging. A wild June. A wild raging has appeared. What's up, raging? We literally came in right as I finished the glass platform. The stage is complete, I think. I think I finished it. Let's go look at the map. Perfect timing. Oh, I missed one pixel. I thought I saw something missing over here. Where is it? Oh, no, it's behind me. There it is. Oh, they can see this on the map. You can literally see the one pixel on the map. I can't reach that far, but over there. He slept through dinner. Oh my gosh. What will you have for dinner now? Tired? Were you... Were you busy this weekend doing activities? Reheated steak. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> uh, reheated steak. Nice. The kids eat in person. It, yeah, the map helps. Like, I can't believe it. Like, I can see one pixel. Like, it's the maps are one to one, which is great. Or not one to one, but. Well, it's one to one as in each piece of the map is one block. Look at that. I slept for three hours last night. Oh my gosh. Set. That doesn't sound like standard raging behavior, is that? I feel like usually you're like, I'm going to bed. It's a little sleep, yeah. I don't get enough sleep. Not three hours, but like... A complete glass stage. Yes. 
that's fair. Though, to just sleep through dinner. A little late night steak. It's not even that late, though. You sleep at least seven. At least seven hours, usually. 20 mile bike ride. Let's go. Yeah. I went for on a six mile hike on Sunday. I went on a six mile hike. And then yes, and then today I moved an entire apartment for work. <laughs> so I'm really tired today. You saw the hike, yes. They were so active. <laughs> I'm not as active as it seems. I also live right next to a trail. I like I like nature stuff. Yeah, so I'm like really, really sleepy today. But um, I like my nature nature hikes and stuff. I live like pretty close to a trail. I can just like get on it and go. And the last time I've done that six mile hike was a month ago. So it's not as active as it sounds. <laughs> Bike ride was Sunday, gotcha. My days are all mixed up too with the holiday weekend, the three day weekend. Yeah, one of my uh, streamer friends went live yesterday evening and I'm like, what are they doing live on a Sunday night? That's interesting, that's new, but it was Monday. Why stand when you can sit? <laughs> Why sit when you can stand? Look at those two mottos. Two completely opposite mottos. Why sit when you can lay down lie down? <laughs> right, it is Tuesday, yeah. Now I'm off on Friday, so I literally have a three day week this week. I am so happy. I think my mood's gonna increase over time with having Fridays off. Look at this. So. Oh, it's, it's almost break time. Wonder what I should do next. If I should just mine. Should I finish this map? By finish the map, I mean like. Cover these in black glass. Just to make the map and then solidify it. Lock it, rather. But I don't know if I want this to be the locked final map. Maybe that's fine. That would be cool to have. Should we have a map of just it being black before I do anything else? I think that'd be kind of neat. I could leave the gateways. I'll just cover the water. Because the gateways are on this map. Not with the red, though. Get rid of the red dot. That's a mangrove trap door. That's what that is. It's a mangrove trapdoor, the red dot. I'm so close to it. So I'll get rid of the mangrove trapdoor and then I'll like just leave the I'll leave the um gateway because it's in the other map. But I'll I'll hide the water. <laughs> it's so funny, this little blue line. One. 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 Can I just get a standing desk or a lap desk? <laughs> so true. Yeah, the fully mapped out bl blacked out. The mapped out black would be cool, yeah. Cause we might do other stuff to this island at some point. Like I might add a laser light show in the beacons. And then I might add We'll probably build something around the actual gateways, like an actual structure. But that's not coming anytime soon, so I think it'd be good to have this version. So then when I get back from my break, um, I need another fun drink called LaCroix Black Raspberry. And then that's it. <laughs> I'll be back. And I'll probably do, I'll, I'll finish, clean up this map a little bit, and then we'll just probably just do binding and stuff. Oh, by the way, I need Bones SMP people. I think 
I think June did. I don't know if Raging you did it yet, but the um the rules were updated in the Discord, so you have to get the roll again for Bones SMP. Um for next for once we update it and stuff. It's the whitelist is the same, but uh, to reacquire the Bones SMP roll. Yeah. Thank you for lurking, Geo. You can't make, you don't have to. You don't have to. <laughs> you can't make me, LOL JK. Not me, my brain just skipping over the LOL JK part. <laughs> I'm going to, oh my god, was that like reverse psychology or something? Okay. Um, I can't believe this is done. That went really well. So was six, my guess was six more shulker boxes full of glass, and it was less than six. I have this much left over. Actually, I started with some glass in my inventory, so maybe it was six. So I'm gonna put this in here, empty my inventory, and I need rockets so I can get down from the tower after. I refilled my rockets over the weekend. Hog. Oh, did I look at? Okay, I didn't look at them. I thought I looked at them when I was flying up. I got scared. You don't have a lap desk. Oh no. Do you have a scientist at home and at work? Yes, that's true. Look at this island. Wow. Should I go on this side? I usually stand on this side. Let me stand on this side for once. Cool, we got a different shape, different view. I always stand on that side because it's the tallest pillar. Cool, and you can see the two maps down there. They're, just, they're tiny, but they're there. Alright, I'll be back. I'm gonna go take a break. There's an ad going anyway. Perfect timing. I actually usually go after that, so... Look at me go. Looks like a starry butthole. It is a starry butthole.
Hello, what is all that? What is all this? What is all this stuff? Pocket leaves. I mean, all right. Let's welcome the raiders. Hi, raiders. And then we'll then we'll catch up on the table desk chat that occurred during the BRB screen. Welcome in. Hello. Thank you for the raid, bestie. Pocket leaves. If you don't know pocket leaves, I'll I'll introduce them first, and then I'll introduce myself. Um, go follow pocket leaves. They're great. With that new profile pic, amazing. Um, yeah, lots of Minecraft. They've been doing The Last of Us. Go follow. Click the linky. The linky in the chat. Why did I say linky? I hate that. Um, anyway, hi, I'm Doc Brennan. My pronouns are they and he. And I play lots of Minecraft here, so if you like Minecraft, click the follow button. You'll always have that content here. I also do other games sometimes, like Zelda. I'm playing Tears of the Kingdom a little bit. And whatever else I feel like. But yeah, welcome, welcome. If you got a raid and run. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Do what you gotta do after your stream. Goes for anyone that came on the raid as well. Let me say hi to everyone. Pinky, welcome in. Pocket Leaves, you're so cool. You're on break right now, but we're coming into a warm chat. I love that. June and Raging were keeping it warm with a spicy conversation about desks. Standing desks, sitting desks, laying down, lying down desks. Undead, thanks for coming on the raid. Negan, the art life. Let me know if I'm saying your name right. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow as well. The goat. Yes, the goat horn. It does a different goat horn each time. Did I say life is strange? I f no, I said the last of us. I always do that. Those two. I always do that. Why do I do that? Not the last of us. Don't follow, po <laughs> at least for last of us. Follow for life is strange. I always do that. Yeah, the goat horn. It's a different goat horn, e horn each time. Fun stuff, right? Yeah, if anyone, if I say anyone's name wrong too, let me know. And if you have, uh, if you like, have a nickname or anything, I'd be happy to call you by that. And also, if you like to share pronouns, if you're new here, and I don't already know them. Getting some food. Yes, get some food. What's the food you're getting? What kind of food you getting? Please say it's nuggies. No, don't see what to say that. I'm just curious. If you're already gone, no worries. Laying down desks. It's a lap desk, uh-huh. You did say rake. Very cool. Well, welcome in. Do you like Minecraft? I also play Stardew. That I haven't played. I was on like a month hiatus, so like all my games kind of got messed up. Um, but I, I also play Stardew and I play all different kinds of things. But yeah. Loving your energy? That's really sweet. I appreciate that. Thank you. We're we're pretty chill here. Pretty cozy. I like to play Minecraft. Just play the block game. Vibe. Hang out. And sometimes it gets a little chaotic sometimes. That's for sure. The cozy kind, though. When you had to eat in bed. Oh my gosh. I mix up stuff all the time. Yeah. True, true, true. But yeah, so what we're I'll explain what we're doing here as well. Um This end island, for anyone that knows Minecraft, this is the island where you fight the Ender Dragon. And we are replacing it with a singular sheet of glass. Which we actually just finished before I took a break. And then we are deleting the island below it. So that's going to be a long, long-term project. Which I'm going to try to recruit help for. We'll see if anyone wants to help me ever. <laughs> I didn't even ask yet, so I don't know yet. Um, but... Yeah, it'll be, um... It's a fun project. We're getting rid of it. So it's going to just be this glass little platform.
Not for playing solo card games. Oh my god. I love this desk conversation. June, one thing I saw during my break was I just saw June saying that's so <laughs> you have so many desks to raging. How many desks do you have though? Peanut butter and Nutella sandwich probably. Ooh, that sounds great. Enjoy, enjoy. About keeping your laptop from heating up too much. What if you need to keep your lap warm? Also, no, that usually feels pretty terrible, actually. <laughs> Laptop on the actual lap. Burning vibes. Oh my god, Geo. Thank you. Me? I, I don't know what I said that would have... You're wondering? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Geo. <laughs> I'm still catching up. I also missed some stuff from uh, before. Oh, me? Is that in, like... You'd be down to help destroy the island? Was that also about helping destroy the island? I would love help to destroy the island. But I'll actually like ask if like in the Discord too to see if actually anyone wants to give me a hand. So I did some calculations, I did some maths, and I think to delete the whole island. Let's fly around. Let's take a look. I almost flew right into that gateway because I wasn't looking. To delete this whole island. I did a little calculations of time, and I think my get best guess was around 200 hours worth of... It was like 187 hours or something. Probably like 200 hours <laughs> worth of solo digging. I'm like, we're gonna have to figure something out. Whether it's recruiting help, or I build some sort of machine. Bomb them? How are you going to do that without destroying the blocks, though? We can't destroy the blocks. How are you going to- how are you going to do that? The end- the end stone. Yeah. We're collecting it all. We're co we're keeping it all. No destroying. I've been trying to find machines to do it. We're just flying around, but no luck yet, because most like quarries or auto miners destroy the blocks, and I don't want to do that. Like not just break them, like totally destroy the item too. I am chaos. There is only yelling. Yeah, raging is raging. It's true. Hey B, what's up B? Let me give a shout out for B. There's another goat horn for y'all. It does break them, but the problem... Oh, I see what you mean. Just, like, manually... Manually, like, TNTing it. Um, we're just gonna start mining while we vibe. We're listening to the Minecraft Dungeon soundtrack, by the way. Um... I see what you mean, uh, Yasserin. I think... So yeah, if, if the TNT blows up the dropped item, then it would destroy the dropped item. So like, if you have too much TNT going off at the same time, it'll destroy the dropped items on the ground. Um, and to do it manually, I honestly just don't think it's even worth it because like... It's end stone, so it's pretty high blast resistance. So, like, you would need a lot, a lot of TNT. I did something like that when I cleared a deep slate area, like a 100 by 100 block area with TNT without using a TNT duper. And that was a lot of time collecting all that TNT, and it still did a pretty crappy job. It helped, but... I wasn't also trying to save any blocks with that. I was fine with just destroying everything. So. I'm, I'm, I'm still going to try to look into a machine, maybe. Holy archaeology, that is a lot. Right? It's so much digging. And there's nothing interesting inside this island, too. It's just... Just endstone. Nothing interesting in there. How are you, B? Welcome in. How's your... 
How's um how's the adjusting back to life after your trip? The shout out? Yes. Have you not yes. I have so many new things, B. New shout outs, new new everything. All new alerts. Oh wait, so chat. I have my raid alert where it's like the lava wall, but I'm considering changing it. So it's Enderman, that whoop into the screen. Someone type exclamation point whoop. I, I did a little test before stream. It's not exactly set, but for, for those that know how to spell whoop. <laughs> you, could, you could do it again. Is it even showing up in the middle of my screen? I think it's really fast. Oh yeah, there it's too fast. But it's a little test I did before stream today. And what if it was one Enderman per raid or two? Please no one raid me with a lot of people if that happens, if I do that. And it's like all over the screen, you know. It's like random spots. You have to wash your hair, but I shall be back. Enjoy washing your hair. I hope you have an epic hair washing time. You're probably already doing that, and I hope you are. We'll see you later. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about your game? <laughs> no, oh my god. <laughs> what about your game? <laughs> that is so f I'm dead. Oh, that is the first time that's ever happened. We were talking about it earlier. This toffee redeemed her first brain cell. Toffee redeemed her first brain cell and, and someone assumed that like she lost them or something, but it was just the first time. And, um, we were talking about how you can lose <laughs> Well, I'm glad you have one left, bestie. You're valid. I've never- that's the first time that's ever happened. I was like, what is the second message? I'm scared. What is that? Well, I'm sorry for your loss of brain cells, Bestie, but you you will do this, I believe. <laughs> we're always- we're, we're over here, um, what do you call it? Clinging onto our single brain cells all the time in here, so... You're welcome here. <laughs> yeah, but you're gonna read- you're gonna read me with 100k viewers, that's... Probably break the stream... With, um, that many Endermen whooping all over. I know that's actually not what whoop means. Whoop is the sound they're making, like, right now. That's the sound they're making. That's the whoop sounds. But I call it when they teleport. I call that the whoop. <laughs> I just can't stop thinking of that, about that way. Anyway. <laughs> We're mining blocks. We be mining. But miss anyone's chats, by the way. Don't always, don't worry, don't hesitate to send them again. I think I caught most of everything, but I think I got the gist of the desk conversation as well. Moral of the story: Raging has a lot of desks. June wants a lying down desk. But 
That's all. I, that's one thing I saw when I was doing my BRB that June said, that's a lot of desks. Do you want a cool desk? But I didn't actually see the rest of that context, so I don't really know what it means. <laughs> Should scroll back up because that was kind of funny. Yeah, it just says. Oh, you have a lap desk too, and June said, You have so many desks. Both my desks at home. I have. Right now I have one desk, but I will have actually multiple at some point. I have like a big table that's currently occupied that I want to make into my desk. Because my desk right now is really small. It is not a cool desk. It's really small. My computer barely fits on it. Can I take all the desks? Yeah. Do you have a standing desk, Yesrin? What kind of desk do you have? Are you standing desk kind of kind of person? Are you a are you a, a lap desk? Are you a regular desk? I'm a table desk person. I don't actually have a desk. It's literally a table. Is that Tekken? Tekken has 16 brain cells. <laughs> Do you really do? You want to? Yeah, cool desk would be cool. You want a bigger desk too? Yeah, I have a table that's like I want to make into my main one. Tech, welcome in. You missed it before. I don't know if you saw it, but like right before, like a few minutes before you came in, Tech, and redeemed your brain cell. Paco leaves redeemed their brain cell and did the honor of losing all their brain cells the first time ever in my stream. They're down to one again. It was, a, it was a stream first. Honestly, we should have a leaderboard for that. We should have a leaderboard for that, right? You want an adjustable desk standing and sitting. That would be cool. They are cool. I saw one with like a... That's like... No! Oh, fuck. I'm flying? Fuck. Scared the shit out of me. <laughs> it actually doesn't usually mind them if you like hover over them. So loud. You know, you'd never stand. I feel like I wouldn't either, but maybe if it if it was an option? I don't know. I never tried one. CK, welcome in as well. How are you, bestie? I'll hit my um CK button. That's right there. No head empty, no thoughts in Doc's channel. That's so fair. Honestly, it's kind of how it is. Kind of be like that over here. Is your stream wicked behind or is it just me? I think it's a little behind. I'm, I'm going a little slow reading everything. Like, it's taking me a little- a moment to read everything. But also I think it- like, I read in order- like, I saw your chat come up, CK, but I was reading everything in order, so it took me a minute to get to your chat. It could be behind, though. Okay, JK, no, it's not. How long did it take me to read that? Yeah, 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 I think that's what it was. Table seems easier for streaming stuff. I think so, yeah. I just... I'm like weird with furniture. I don't know what to buy. I just buy whatever feels right. <laughs> so I'm just like, I'm just gonna get that. That seems cool. I like kind of simple stuff. Pee pee poo poo. I read that one really fast. So how fast did that... T how did that seem like it was a long time? Let me see if I missed anything now because I was doing the speed checks. Yeah, I think I got everything else. Yo. 
That was Sonic Speed Fest? Okay. So then I was just catching up. That's all it was, CK. That's probably what it was then. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So if you want me to read a chat really fast, you just have to type pee pee poo poo and it'll be red Sonic Speed Fast. I'm just kidding. That that's not why. That's not why it's red fast. You read mine out of order. Yeah, I sometimes I skip around and sometimes I read things right in order and it my brain be doing burr things. I figured after I saw you shout me out right away. I gotcha. Yeah, no, I gotcha. Just trying to be patient. Well, I appreciate the patience, because, you know, <laughs> sometimes it do be hard for me. Reading is not really one of my strong suits. <laughs> We try our best out here. That's one thing I also said too, is like, if, if I ever miss a chat, like from a while ago or something, and sometimes I do read things and I don't always um, respond right away, or like, sometimes I just read it and like acknowledge it. But you're always welcome to send things again if I do ever miss stuff. I don't, I don't mind that at all. Not like spam beat, but you know what I mean, hopefully. Fucking moot, yeah. Reading is hard. It is. I promise I never want to miss anyone's message. I want everyone's message to be read. True. Yeah, welcome in, friends. What? Oh yeah, for anyone who came in recently, update. Um, the glass stage is done. Yeah, we just beat a level in Minecraft Dungeons. We're listening to the Minecraft Dungeons soundtrack, by the way. We just beat a level. <laughs> that sound is so funny. And now we're on the loot screen where you get the loot. We're getting we're getting loot right now. New weapon or item? Artifact even? My inventory's full. Oh my gosh. How many blocks am I wasting? Throw it in the toilet bowl. We Okay, I'm going to throw some on this side too. Okay. Deposit. I did leave before prediction finished last time. What was that come? We, um, did not finish it. We did not have enough glass. So the answer was we did not have enough glass. I finished it today with six shulker boxes. So I, I big time ran out. Which one did you vote for? You must have won then. Yeah. The six from you. Yeah, I, I gave I gave proper credit to the, the one who filled up so many sh what? Why does this keep happening? I never hit them when I'm mining. Oh, here's a bunch of blocks too. So, yeah, we gave we gave credit to Tech for acquiring much shulker boxes of glass. It's the shrimp miner. Oh my god. It's the like um what do you call it? Village trader. Six K deep. Oh my god. That is so funny. Loggy, hello. Welcome in. How are you? Good to see you. Love the little high waving. 
give you a break from lag village. It's not that laggy for me. Actually, someone commented on when I went there on stream last week. Someone commented on how the server is not laggy at all when I was at your base. That's when they made that comment. I'm like, I mean, it's a little, I, my frame rate does drop there a bit, but it's, it's still like definitely not that laggy for me. All the end zone in the toilet bowl. Good, you? I'm doing pretty good. I'm really tired. I had a very busy, physically demanding day at works and whatever, so I'm tired, but otherwise I'm pretty good. <laughs> Break from the village, yeah. 6k deep. Oh my god. Is that like, is that like six feet deep? <laughs> I don't know what that means. I probably know what it means, but... I just want to make sure this is all getting sucked into the shulker boxes. Yeah. Cool, it all fit in the hoppers. These hoppers are spinning in a circle, so like, it'll pass the blocks around and by the time it gets, before it gets down there. So it all fits in, or whatever. Uh, we're good. Keep mining. Wait, should we do... Bones Robot knows how to do math now. I must away. Have fun destroying the island. See you later, June. We will have fun. We could do math. Does anyone want to type the math? It's exclamation point math, and then here are the, the things. It's um, 64 times 9 times 3. You have to do the little asterisk, by the way. 64 times 9 times 3 times 9 times 5. And then we have to add, fuck, another box. Fifty f instead of nine times f fuck, I'll just type it. Minus <laughs> and do exclamation point maths. Yeah, before that, and it'll do it. And we have to add two shulker boxes. Minus two, frick. And then shulker. Well, I did five, so it's five rows. So we have to add these two. So maths. 64 times 9 times 3 times 2. So you can do maths and then add those two, and that'll be how much um, end stone we have so far. Yes, sir, and this is why we're not destroying the end stone, is we're collecting all of it just so we can literally count how many blocks this island is made out of. That's the only silly reason we're doing it this way. And we're going to build a mansion for the Enderman on an outer island. That's also the other reason. Not out of all the blocks, but... Oh yeah, let's look at this stage. I was coming over here to show that this is done. But then I got realized my inventory's full. Got distracted by maths. There we go. Bones Robot knows how to do math now. Isn't that cool? <laughs> you can also do math or calculate, I think. Those all work. Oh wait, so sorry I was terribly late and also now I have to lurk. No worries, Tech. I hope you have a great night. Thanks for popping in. I appreciate that. Hope you have a great sleep. If you're already gone, rest well, bestie. You can you can do math <laughs> without the S too, but I, I we have options, you know. So, so far, 81,216 blocks. Very cool. Y yeah. Well, then, you can, that one's made for you. So, this is the island. This is before. This is it now. It's an ink blot. This is what it looks like in real life. It's the same shape as the island. Exact. Same shape. That's it. We did it.
Time to keep mining more blocks. Mine straight across here. How we doing, chat? Anyone who came in more recently, how are you? What what are we up to? What are we doing tonight? It's Tuesday, not to be confused with Monday. I'm I'm rubber banding. I'm lagging. That's interesting. Um, 1.20 coming in a couple weeks. So I've been thinking for the server, since we're on a paper type server, it's like this actual server type, I think I'll wait, because that usually comes out like a week to 10 days after the actual release comes out. I think I'll just wait for it instead of converting back to a vanilla server and then having to convert it back to paper once that comes out. Unless people like are really impatient for the 1.20, not impatient, just like really want it. Uh, I guess I'd be impatient, but I think I'll probably just wait. It's only like a week or so. I'll do whatever people want, generally. But I'm really hype. I think at that point, too, I'll announce a the, our summer festival, which we'll start preparing for. I'm really excited for that, too. The summer festival, I'm like mining this endstone in the, in the middle of the fucking void with just like the starry background and like mundane colors. I'm talking about a summer festival, like a party, like a little really fun, colorful event. <laughs> I'm just here. Um, anyway, it's going to be after the spring festival, physically. In the in the actual mangrove swamp, we haven't had a festival in the swamp yet. It's all been in the desert. It's gonna be in the mangrove swamp, and I think there might be. And we're gonna build on top of the trees. I don't think I've talked about this on stream very much at all. We talked about it when we did the the spring festival, but I wasn't streaming. It's gonna be in the mangrove swamp, and it's gonna be on the treetops. So it's gonna be like um, like tree tree houses with bridges going between them like on the canopy with like yeah the bridges for being the pass to get to each attraction I think it'll be really fun might do a bit of a um controlled burn to like clear out some ground space as well and also to, like, fit the lore of, like, kind of the summer theme. Do a little, a little control burn. But I'm going to do that once 1.20 arrives, for sure. Did anything fall down here? These beacons are going to look so weird once I get past this level of mining. Because there's going to be floating in the air, and I don't really like that. It kind of makes me a little uneasy thinking about that. I think I'll move them down to the bottom of the build out the platform below. A day of August. Welcome. Hi, readers. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the raid. Uh, if you're new here, hi, my name is Doc Brennan. 
Uh, my pronouns are they, he, and I play lots of Minecraft here. So if you like that, stick around. Um, drop a follow if you like. I also play Stardew. I play Br Tears of the Kingdom as well. Play all different kinds of things, but welcome in. Faye Magpie, hello, welcome. How are you doing? How is stream? If you want to tell me all about it, what you get up to? Let's get a shout out for August here. Shout out. What'd they get up to? What'd you get up to? Zero escape. Interesting. Nine hours, nine persons, nine doors. That sounds cool. Hope your stream was good. If you gotta go take care of yourself after your stream as well, please go do what you gotta do. But yeah, what we're doing here, we are working on a big project. It's called Delete the Entire End Island. So we're literally just mining this whole island away. Right now, we're gonna come up with other methods in the future. One that includes recruiting help to mine. And then two, maybe a building machine to help get rid of this. And it's getting replaced with a glass platform, glass stage, if you will, where you'll fight the Ender Dragon on a big epic battle arena. It's reading the game chat. That's not for me, right? The Enrods? On Cece's tower. Tiny tower. Love the tiny tower. Is, is that about... Oh my god, Raging's calling things tiny tower. Has anyone played the game tiny tower, though? Has anyone ever played the game tiny tower? The, fo the phone game? There's gotta be one person in the chat that's played tiny tower before. So far we have mined 80, it's probably like 82,000 blocks now, basically. How many to go? 2.5 million minus 82,000. We tried guessing how many blocks this island is. It's very hard to estimate because it's tremendous. Oh wait, I got- I forgot I got a new drink. I, um, I opened it. I was like drinking a LaCroix before stream. And then when I started stream, I wanted a fresh one where it was like super cold. So I like put the half empty one into the fridge. And took a new one. Felt silly. I don't know why that- it just like felt so silly for no reason. And then I got the half empty one that's in the fridge. That's- that's my- that's my life story about LaCroix. It was um, pretty epic. Ooh, I gotta kind of repair my pickaxe soon, I think. Oh, 
Oh, it's still pretty good. It's like halfway. I'll like get really low on the durability and then... I haven't broken it yet by accident. The only time I've ever broken a netherite pickaxe by accident was... Well... Yeah, it was on when I was mining ice in my hardcore because it, the durability drops fast when you're mining ice. Because it's like instant break or whatever. We're talking about towers in in the game chat. Raging just suggested we need a rainbow tower in the city. We have some skyscrapers going on. I think I will do it this time. I'm gonna try to build the rainbow beacon that I built before at the summer festival. Even though I think our festival will be post Pride Month, I think it'll probably be in July, but, you know, vibes. And Lurk, where are you punching stone at spawn from AFK Mining to? <laughs> um, yes. I think you're right about that tech. I was gonna say, I'll, that reminded me of like, Early in my Minecraft days, I was mining for netherite, and my keybind for dropping the item used to be Q as the default, and I was mining, 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 and I threw the- I threw the pickaxe like- oops. Like this. Like I'm mining, 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 I threw the pickaxe like that into lava, and I didn't know at that point in my Minecraft career that- Netherite tools don't burn in lava. So I thought- I just- I just deemed it gone, so I just left. <laughs> so that one... is another netherite pickaxe destroyed by not know- knowing... that they don't burn in lava. When this be celebrates pride year round? Exactly. We need a new banner sh we need a new banner spot cuz there's one at the summer festival but we need we need one in the desert city I think for just like uh the pride banners and flags I was going to post that in the discord like an idea if someone wants to do that So I don't know if like I would like to do it but I don't know if like there might be someone who would actually really want to do it I think it'd be a fun project for anyone that's interested. Pride Museum? Yeah. Yeah. I think just like, yeah, anything. And a, a place for people to gear up, too. A little Pride Museum with a little, a little, um, free shop. I think it should be free. I don't think people should sell them. The flags and banners. I'm gonna put pride things in my museum that's been waiting to be built for a rear. So fair. So, oh, talking about museums. I think I mentioned this about the wanting to build one for the, um... What do you call it? For the fossils that we found? And I looked at I, I checked it out. And there is one under the desert city. So I can build a museum in the city. And it's literally underneath it. 
so that's pretty hype. The thing is, I have to I have to figure out. So it's directly under a plot of a build that's unfinished. The plot next to it is free, so I could like go down and build next to it. But I I don't know if I want to or not. Like I don't know if anyone has an opinion on this. The person that's thing it is is not here. Um, I don't think, but. I was gonna ask them if I could just move their build over one plot because it's like unfinished for like a year. I don't want to like get rid of it, but I'm thinking to ask if I should if I can move it over a plot, a plot, or I just build the plot next to it and go underneath theirs to get to the actual, uh, which would be fine, honestly. Because I don't think their build is going down. Yeah, like, I don't really care, like, it's honestly fine, because I could just go underneath and, like, build underneath. Yeah, I haven't asked yet, because I don't really, like, care to, to, like, decide it yet. And I'm thinking if I really want that or not, I could just ask either way. But I definitely wouldn't do it without asking, because I do, this person I do like. So, I don't want to mess up their thing. I'll probably just, like, copy it over or something. But it, 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 I could build under the plot next to it. It'd actually be fine. Because then you could have, like, a little tunnel going to the display area where the, where the fossil is. Which I think would work out fine. And I don't think their build would go down that deep. It's definitely not. It looks like a surface build. A lot of people don't really dig down anyway. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be really cool, right? It's like right in the city. It's right there. If I don't move the build... The plot is right in front of the travel agency. It's right, right, right in front of the my other build. I know you didn't mean it this way, but when you said... That made me sound like there's people on the server, you dis... <laughs> I'm glad you found it humorous. <laughs> Not the eyeball emoji. <laughs> I can see how that would sound. <laughs> Not a bombastic side eye. Sheesh. CK hates sheesh. I'm gonna get- I'm gonna get called out. <laughs> I'm glad you found that humorous. That is very amusing. Criminal offensive side eye. I love the side eye, like, trend at the moment. It's so good. It makes me laugh so much. It's a very nice satisfying pit. It's a toilet bowl for all the endstone. They just throw all the blocks down there and they go in the middle and then they get packed up into shulker boxes right here. It's just because we're mining so much and I cannot think about loading that manually. So it's a it's got a shulker box loader and then there's a um there's an item filter here, a little um, auto sorter, just so um, in case something goes in there that's not end stone, like an ender pearl or just some random thing, because then if something else goes in here, the shulker box loader breaks, because it has to be like full of the same item or it doesn't work. So yeah, so it filters out things that are not end stone. And yeah, lo loads it up. Those chests, that array of nine chests, I think can hold up to like 850,000 endstone or something like that. So that'll keep me busy for a while. Keep us covered, rather, is what I mean. Yuck, 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 says CK. <laughs> Love it.
You see like stuff like that in Hovercraft, right? It's so useful. That's my first time building a loader because it's actually like super useful here and like worth it. It's a very easy thing to build, honestly. Much easier than the unloader, to be honest. Very helpful. So I just throw all the items in, down into the toilet bowl in the center. I figure the center will always be kind of the best spot. And even if I do consider building a an excavator, which would be like a flying machine that like brings all the blocks to one spot and then you blow them up with TNT. If I build something like that, which I don't think it will be necessary or worth it rather. Um they could just have it blow up into the same spot. So that same loader will be ready. Uh, yeah. I was like, my inventory can't be full. I just emptied it. In the satisfying pit. Yeah, like when I first started, I knew I was going to build a loader situation like that, but when I first started, I was like putting it into shulker boxes and then putting it into a chest. I'm like, it's not that much effort, but it, it was still effort. And it's under the island. No, well, not completely under, but I should actually put it all the way under now that I think about it. I don't know how far you can build under the end island, though. Probably zero. I don't actually know. The bottom of the island is at, like, Y11? I think? I don't actually know. What's the build limit, the lower limit? I guess it's where the void actually starts hurting you. Which I actually don't know where that is. Now I feel like we gotta do science. I don't really feel like doing science right now, but kind of curious. I know in the overworld you can only build, you can't build below the bedrock at all. I think there's like glitches you can do or something. Because people build upside down houses sometimes under the overworld. I don't know why they do that, but in the void. I guess it makes sense. The only, the only other project I saw that someone did something like this where they removed the whole end island, they they didn't do it manually, but they did it with TNT dupers and like flying machines, and they just you know bombed the entire island and just destroyed it over time with that. Um, but then they they made the end, the main island. Um, like an overworld island and then they like put a village on it but it's upside down and all the mobs on it are upside down like they named them dinner bone or whatever so they flipped upside down so it was a pretty cool idea i don't know why but it was just fun i guess yeah, so yeah, because I did a little, when I first started the project, I had done no research, really, when I first thought about it, and then I'm like, let me see if anyone's, because someone came in, they're like, oh, I've never seen something like this before, I'm like, yeah, I don't think I have either, and then I was like, let me look at, I'm just curious, let me see if anyone has done something like this, and there was one video I found that, that's what they did. It does sound cool. It was cool. It was pretty cool. Yeah. I'd use, use a lot of TNT, but that's with the thought of not wanting to keep the ends. Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't really need to. Maybe I'll give up halfway and I'll do that. <laughs> I actually didn't even consider that an option yet. We had a couple people raise their hand and consider offering help tonight so we may have some help
to manually mine, which would be good. Shannis! It's the three hour mark exactly. It's not all caps, but with spaces between the letters. Doc. Let's get in. I'm gonna go feed the baby. Absolutely. Welcome uh, back. Right, you were here earlier. Am I making that up? No, you were here earlier. Yeah, we were talking about donuts and stuff. Yeah, and, and, um... My brain is so mushy. <laughs> Feed the baby. I'm almost done with this layer. I didn't start this layer today, but we're almost done with another full entire layer, which is fantastic. Down into the toilet bowl of endstone. I'm gonna go back to this side, I guess. I think part of the motivation for keeping all the end zone too, one, so we can count all the blocks, two, it won't be exact because we will lose some, but it's fine. Um, but then the other motivation is, what's the other motivation? Um, to build the mansion. There's another one. Oh, to make use of shulker boxes, since we built that like that, like, extremely overpowered shulker farm. I'm like, we're never gonna use that many shulker shells on the server. But here, I have a reason now <laughs> to fill as many shulker boxes as possible. I'll actually have to AFK there, if you can believe it. So that's cool. I like that we'll actually have to use, have some use for them. <laughs> It's so, that's, that farm is wild. It's cool though. That was such a fun group build. That I had so much fun doing that. And it went like so well. Like the teamwork was immaculate. Amazing. Sick. Okay, cool. Resume. Resume digging. Time is it? Ten thirty. I might do a bit of a shorter stream. I might just finish this layer. I still have like a bunch left. I have a section over there and this bit, which isn't that much, but I'll probably just finish this layer. So I kind of want to make cookies and eat them before bed. I'm streaming again tomorrow. I'm doing it Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday this week. Um, so I may. I don't know what I'm gonna stream tomorrow though. I don't know. I really figure out what I want to do. I don't think I'm ready to dive back into Stardew yet.
Oh, if I crouch. I'm looking more straightforward. I don't have to angle down as much. <laughs> I'm not doing that. I don't want to hold control. No thanks. I feel like I want to build something, um... I want to build something from Minecraft dungeons in Minecraft. There's that one, like, underwater level that was really cool, that I was, like, really... I think the last time I played Minecraft dungeons on stream, we did that. And it's, like, really cool half underwater room and then, like, surrounded by water on the outside. It would be like, it would definitely be a mega build. I don't know if I want to do that still, but now I just started thinking... Like, what if I created... A dungeon crawler <laughs> in my- in- in the server. Where, like, you have mob spawners that, like, send, like... Um, mobs- like, mob farms that, like, send mobs out into a sort of dungeon as you run through it and try to fight your way through. That would be kind of interesting. I think that would be doable too. And maybe inspire it off of Minecraft dungeons. I'm trying to think of other projects to do. Because I'm not going to just... This isn't the only Minecraft content we're going to be doing, by the way. I'm not going to be mining most of this on stream as I get through it. Just because I don't think I want 100 and or 200 hours of content doing this necessarily. A lot of this will be off stream. Yeah, like, if I do, like, well, like, five hours a stream, 200 hours, that's 20 streams, right? So, yeah, it's about six months of my- yeah. I mean, that's not that ridiculous. It's not that ridiculous. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous, like, for me, but... One big street, 200 hours, that's the... <laughs> I don't know if you're here before, but I did some, like, estimating of how long it would take. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. Yeah. Do it. Easy. <laughs> that's so funny. I was just spitballing a number that sounded funny. Yeah, well, I did- I, like, mined a section. I mined for, like, ten minutes straight the other day. Just to see how long it takes, and that included, like, you know, messing up and, like, whatever. A little bit. Um, cause that's what- how it works. And that's just, like, straight focused mining. It came out to about 200 hours to mine the whole thing. So, five hour streams. Hold on. Oh, it's 40 streams. I said 20. 40 divided by 3, because you just stream 3 days. So that'd be like 13 weeks. So it'd be like 4 months, probably. Like, realistically. If, I, if that's all I streamed. 3 days a week. 
Yeah, you're actually pretty close in the estimate, in the funny estimate, yeah. <laughs> I love the big one, one big stream solution though. That's pretty epic. Alright, I gotta repair my pickaxe before I break it. Should I do it now or should I finish the strip? No, let's do it now. You have returned. Welcome back. We have probably like another 20 to 30 minutes of stream. So I'm gonna end after I finish this layer. So I'll be back tomorrow again as well. I had to rebuild that bridge someday. That would be good. Oh, I wanna finish the map actually. Yo, the maths. Okay, loud, loud noises. Let me get my Enderman button ready. Nice maths command. Minathon. The only way that. Like, if, if we had enough people that grouped up to do it, we could probably do it in, like, a reasonable amount of time. I think the, um, maths command also considers parentheses and everything. It's pretty rad. Am I repaired yet? I'm just still doing- no, I'm not repaired. YouTube only Minecraft series on Brain Rot SMP. Playlist here. Oh, whoa. Oh. PEMDAS. Exactly! It does the PEMDAS. Everything. Okay, is this done? Please finish. Okay. All right, sounds are over. Apologize for any ear issues that occur. Is it like way too loud or is it just like is it just like a lot of noise when I do that? Is it just like a lot of noise? <laughs> All good. Yeah. Cool. Okay. <sighs> like, reasonable. Yeah, yeah, Nah, no, like, t yeah, I got it. That is good feedback. I appreciate it. Alright, so this is not the very last thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna touch up the map and lock it before I end, because I, I want that to be done. Where should we put the maps? Should I put- oh, wait! I can put the map when you enter the island. That's a pretty good spot. Yeah, is that a good spot? Yeah, it's- I mean, it's fine. Because then it kind of explains the lore when you arrive. Perfect spot, yeah. That's pretty cool. I like that. And it's actually an odd number. It's a five wide platform which is perfect because it's a three by three map so i could like center it vertically i can center it vertically which is great instead of side by side i think that would look really nice cool What should I stream tomorrow? Should I do a poll? I'm gonna do a poll. I don't know if anyone will vote on it, but... I'm gonna do it anyway. What should I stream tomorrow? Um... Stream tomorrow... Uh... Near... Replicant... Minecraft Legends... More Minecraft... There's two other games on the list. I don't think I want to play Stardew again, but I'll put it on here. Doesn't mean I'll listen to what anyone says. Stardew. And... The last option would be... I don't think I would do Tears of the Kingdom tomorrow. Because I'm playing it on Saturday, too. 
What other games do I have that I've been playing? Yeah, that's it. Start pull. Start pull. I did the pull. Like, near Replicant, I feel like I'm close to finishing. Actually, I'm not really sure. It doesn't really matter. Horror game. Do Stark, since it's not Stardew. Yeah, Minecraft Legends would be, like, more of that, because I, I did, like, a good amount of it, but... I don't think I'll stream it much more. It'll be like one or two more streams of that. Horror game. Oh, do you, do you just mean like another game? Like a horror game? What horror game should I play? I've never played one on stream. <laughs> For a second, I thought you meant like Do Star is the horror game because it's, you know, Star Do reversed. Um, it does have an end, I think. Like, I think there's, like, the main campaign, yeah. There's, like, a main campaign. You can, like, play it again and again after, though. Yeah, there's definitely a, a com campaign, yeah. Which I'm currently doing. I don't think it should be that long. So I don't think I'll, like, play it more after that on stream. Like, I don't think it's interesting enough like I don't think that'll be a game that rots my brain not like not like the minecrafts <laughs> near question mark exclamation point it's on there so far we are tied Yo, a tiebreaker? Not sure what kind of horror games do you like. I don't really play any. The only horror game I ever really played was when I was a child. And I played a tiny tiny little wee baby. I played... Actually, I actually played a few games. Silent Hill. I played that with my cousin when I was... Probably too young to be playing that. That was great. I really enjoyed that. And then I played Fatal Frame. I think that was on GameCube. I really liked that as well. But other than that, I never really played any like current horror games. I don't think. Have I? I don't think so. I don't think I have. Well, I played World of Horror. Which is a different kind of horror. That's just like psychologically taxing <laughs> yeah all right we got three votes for near i would like to finish that because like i want to like um i want to like m finish it so i can move on from it because like i'm playing tears of the kingdom too so it's like two sort of like action RPG type games. So I want to just have one of those at the moment. And Tears of the Kingdom is so freaking tremendous that that'll last a while. So that could be like my other game that I play once a week or whatever. I think I'll like the next part too. I love... I loved most of the parts so far. The reading part that Raging, you're like, oh, this part. <laughs> I knew what you meant when that happened. But I did really like it, though. It was just, it was just a lot to read on stream. It was just a lot. It went on for so long. Like, the, the premise was really interesting, though. And the stories it told were actually really well told, so I really liked it. But it just it just hurt, <laughs> physically. <laughs> Short indie horror. Some of the best. Oh, you know what's something I want to play? I seen it. One of my friends played it a while ago that I watched him play, and I saw someone else playing it recently, too. Um, Project Zomboid. 
don't know if that's like really a horror. It's not really like a horror game. It's like more of like a survival game. I think. I don't think that genre is horror really. But that one looks really fun. This is Project Zomboid. Is it Zomboid or Zomboy? Project Zomboid. Yeah. Project Zomboid. It's like a survival zombie game. It does have something to do with zombies. Exactly. Yeah. You watch someone play it? Yeah. It's really fun. It. It looks really cool, and it's like really kind of hard. It's like a hard game. And so we have four. All right, so near replicant is tomorrow, unless we have some like random wave of votes. I like the reading part. It was so annoying though, but I know for sure you'll like the mansion. Yeah, no, I know. I liked like the reading part was really cool. The like I feel like the storytelling was really solid. It's just on stream was just like hurt my fucking throat for for who forever didn't see that part of near it's essentially a part where it's just white text on a black screen and it's like a text it turns into a text adventure and it's like reading it's just like a lot of freaking reading and it lasted like i don't know like an hour something like that it was a lot it was cool Good story. <laughs> but I think I'll like the next part as well. Yeah. That. I feel like kind of like emo like emotions happening when that was going on though. It was kind of cool. Yeah, as soon as something has to do yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not Project Sunpoint's fun. Never played it, but it looks fun. Oh yeah, I was gonna say it's kind of like a hard game though. Like you cannot get bit. Like and if you get bit, you are done. And like you you slowly deteriorate over time and like stuff like that. You need to care about like temperature, I think, like kinda everything. I think you need to care about food and everything too. I really like the art style too. Kinda reminds me of like a Nintendo game. Like Nintendo console game. That's cool. You can play multiplayer too. You have to like start up a server. I feel like I would want to just solo it. I don't know. I do want to. That is kind of on my list to play at some point. But I don't know. If you ever have any, Sha Shanice, if you have any, like, recommendations for, like, indie horror games that you really liked, you're welcome to post them in, I would, if you want to post them in the Discord, that would be super rad. I don't think I'm going to play any really soon, but, can I add to my, like, long-term to-do list? I'll probably do it around Halloween again. I like doing... I did World of Horror and Luigi's Mansion. There, I played Luigi's Mansion. That was my heart, my recent horror game. <laughs> that game was so much fun. B, welcome back. We're talking about horror games. Oh, well, let's talk about what I should play tomorrow, which is a poll. Um, which I think there's a clear winner at the moment, but it's there for a couple, like a mo another minute. You voted! Yo, let's go. Yeah, I think Nier will be great, because I want to, like, finish it. I want to finish it. Because I got Tears of the Kingdom. Minecraft. And then I think after I finish one of the- finished Nier, I might bring Stardew back. Still want to 100% it. <laughs> to answer your question, jet lag is destroying me. Oh my god. Yeah, remember like the day you got back, you were like... Okay. 
feel like it, I heard you say something about like it not being that bad, and then it then it really hit you or something like that. I'm like, oh, yep. <laughs> yeah, you. Th yeah, it's like I thought you like thought you were fine, and then and then like the t couple of days after, it's just done. I'll look through Shiny. I appreciate that. Yeah, Amnesia Collection. Ooh. It sounds interesting. Yeah, pop them in the Discord. I will. Oh. Then I actually can remember too. I lied. It wasn't 20 miles. It was only 15. That's alright. It's still a lot of miles. Do you like bike? Where did you bike? Is it like on a trail or is it just like on the road? I mean, 15, that would be a really long trail if it was 15 miles. Tears of the Kingdom is so good, right, Yesarin? So good. Have you been playing it a lot or? I've only played what I've done on stream so far. Like, I'm gonna, I'll play it off stream. I just haven't. Um. My inventory is like bowl, go in the toilet bowl, flush it away. Um, but I'm really enjoying it so far. I'm not that far in. I'm only like 10 hours in, 11 hours, 12 hours. I played a lot on um Saturday last week. Up <laughs> at night, sleepy during the day. Oh my gosh, B. I hope you're. Rhythm gets back into order for you soon. Downtown Austin, mostly trail, but also parts of the city, too. Oh, it sounds really cool. Do you like biking and stuff? Because, like, I considered it actually recently because I have a trail by me that goes on for, like, I don't actually know how many miles it is. How many miles? I'm not going to say the word. Uh, miles. Trail by me. Can you just tell me how long it is? It's like 30 miles? It's like one pretty straight trail. That I'm like, that would be kind of fun to bike on, I feel like. I get a little scared about going on the road and stuff. My spatial awareness is not great. And people kind of make me nervous. It's kind of busy where I live, so I get a little nervous, but... On the trail would be actually really nice. I was thinking about that, because I go hiking on it, but... Yeah. I had a friend when I lived in Brooklyn that would, like, bike every day across the bridge into Manhattan. I was just like, damn, pop off. She was just like, would just go every day go to work. I was like, that's really cool. You have things to do. I have to work on something to send to a friend, but I shall be lurking. Well, I appreciate the lurk. I hope you have a great racing night, B. I'm probably wrapping up soon, actually. I'm just gonna finish update my map here, um, which I came down here to get, what, some black glass to cover the spots of the map that I want to cover. Play games with me till you fall asleep. Do games put you to sleep? Because they do not put me to sleep. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's funny. I don't like getting lost in hilly neighborhoods. It's really hilly where I live, actually. Like, super hilly. Every day when I go home, I walk up a hill that's like... 90 feet in ex escalation. Escalation? Incline? What the f- I'm using the wrong word, I feel like. It's like, at this level, and then the top of the hill is 90 feet higher up in altitude. Something like that. Uh, but the trail by me is on level ground. Yeah. 
I have like 60 hours, but like explore, not the story. That's what I've heard people say, yes, or and it's like people are just like, I've been spending dozens of hours and like barely touched the main quest or whatever. And honestly, when I started streaming it, because I'm like, I'm playing it on stream so far, and I'm like, I just want to like get f like just focus on the quest and not explore a lot. But I keep going off the path and just exploring. It's just kind of how the game is made, though. So uh, it makes sense. People dumb wrote scary. Yes. Absolutely. I wish I did a bike in London. There were like dedicated roads just for bikes. Please. I'm picking up what you're putting down. <laughs> I love when you say that, Bestie. It's so fun. It's Awesome. I love that phrase. Okay, does this cover that fine? Doesn't need to be perfect, or should it be perfect? Oh god, it scared me. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm actually just gonna remove the trap door and just put it back after I'm done. It'll take two seconds. Right. Then it'll be actually the right shade. Because sometimes when there's glass on glass, it... Um... What's going on? I'm going down... Going down a ladder, come on. It scared the fuck out of me. This is gonna make a weird shape on the map. That little glass platform. I should remove that too. I didn't even put one on the other one. Just remove this. It's fine. Eventually these will get like really nice towers of some sort. I don't know what, I have no idea really. But some kind of tower. I don't think the dragon flies this far over, so I think it would be safe. I'd have to research that a bit, because I don't know that for sure. This will show up on the map, but it's okay. Just having a little bit. Oh, I was scared to look at the Enderman, but they're all below the glass. There's no open spot on the glass anymore. All right, what else did I have to cover? Oh, the water. I might do something kind of weird. I might just, instead of putting one on top, it might, well, let's put one on top, let's see. I, like, I might just remove the top water, just so I can do it and then put it back. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna then lock this map so it doesn't update anymore. You can see it on the ends, it gives it shading. Ah, wrong thing. I thought it was my scope, my little telescope. You can see this corner, but like honestly, that's fine. But these, I'm gonna remove those two dots because those are kind of sus. Like, like what's what's that doing? This one clear. There's an object floating there, and then this one updated. Let's fix that. Uh, let's get some buckets so I can put the water back when I'm done. That would be good. We Okay. Uh, buckets. For anyone who didn't see this too before, this, where this collection room is, it is under the island. Yeah, that's all I have to say about that. There's nothing really to say about that. This is a platform we built down here. We put, like, water down and then, like, floated down and built it. And I love that the pillars go through the entire island. Honestly, isn't that sick? I think it's sick. How cool is that? Um, and we're keeping the pillars. Yes. Nay, hi. How's it going? How are you? Did add a nay button. Um, this whole platform I'm gonna build out to co to cover the whole island at some point because um. 
once we mine down to this level, we'll need to like catch the blocks and also not fall into the void. So I have to extend this. That could be another block placing stream. Oh goodness. So we got three additional shulker boxes from earlier. We did pretty good. Um is going good, hell yeah. How be buying Minecraft? Minecraft is good. We got a lot done today. The platform where we fight the Ender Dragon is the stage is complete. And then we're just doing some mining, and now I am updating the map. Oh. I'll go back down. I need to get some glass panes to lock the map. So we're updating the map. Look at this map. From a distance, it kind of looks cool. It's like, looks kind of ominous. I'm going to have to make a new one because this marker, I hate that these markers don't go away when you pick up the map. It's kind of weird. You should be able to get rid of them. Yin and yang, yeah. So true. Um, I'm remove. I didn't get- I went down there to get buckets. I didn't get my buckets. I got distracted by how cool it is that the pillars go through the islands. They're like piercing the island. Okay, um, I didn't get my buckets. I literally took out my toolbox so I could get them, but I didn't get the water. The buckets. We got buckets now. We. I love flying up that. Ladder. I don't know why. It's fun. But yeah, it's going good. So this is the platform. It's done. Completely covered in glass. Yeah, the purple lighting around the void is eerie and I agree. It so kind of makes this like kind of fun in the end too. It's like just so pretty here all the time. It's very peaceful. Okay, so that is covered. So I'm covering up a few spots that are like um, not black glass temporarily just so I can make this map be done. Hey, right, that's better. Cool. I think it looks good. Wait, this one didn't update with the trapdoor. There we go. Trapdoor is gone. Looks good. Okay, so now I need some maps. I need to redo the maps in the center um, to get rid of the green marker. Yeah, those green markers don't go away once you place them in an item frame. It's really annoying. They should just be temporary. <laughs> so if you like pick it up and put it down over and over again, it just keeps adding markers. It's like so rude. And I think this has my wait. Not that. This one. I should have a cartography table and glass, hopefully, in here. Yes. Cool. So we can lock maps. Yeah, but it's been going good. Just vibing. Doing the block game. This Minecraft Dungeons music is kind of like elevator music, and we're like kind of on an elevator right now. For a second there. Now it's not really, but... <laughs> it's the Minecraft Dungeons soundtrack. Playing us up the elevator. feels really nice to have this platform done. Alright, so this is a bit confusing. So, all of these maps... This is trash. Need my cartography table. My glass panes. I'm gonna take stuff off my hotbar so I can do this easily. So one through nine, actually, is the maps. 
Um, these are maps of this wall locked. So, like, even this one shouldn't have the green marker on it. Like that one, so I have a copy of that. First thing I'm gonna do is make a copy of that. This is my, um... My shulker box for the travel agency, since I have a travel agency on the server. So I have, like, materials to carry around with me that I might need. Like, making maps. Um... Putting signs down, banners. Item frames, signs, yeah, I said that, signs. Die, to die my signs. Yeah, I love this little box. I haven't used it a lot lately, but it's a good one. Okay, so I need to make one copy of this. Does it stay locked? It sh they're both locked. Okay, cool. Because I'm going to be throwing away the one in the middle here. What is this? What is that? Oh, it's just the center map. What is that? Oh my god, the map with the shulker box down. I need to pick those up before I make that final one. Alright, so I'm gonna pick these up just so I don't get confused. They're not in my order, but it's fine. They're already in here. Okay. This is garbage. So we're gonna put the L the map near the entrance of the island. Okay, so item frames. The way I have all these scary music discs just in this box. Because I had them at spawn by accident, so I picked them up recently and I just put them in this random box. They're all the scary discs that you play together makes that one really terrifying song. Spoopy, yeah. I realized I left it in the spawn tower <laughs> where we played the song, and I'm like, we had like a new person or two like log in. While they're just sitting there, I'm like, that's like the first thing they see when they join the server. <laughs> like, they don't need to be there. Those boxes. The, the jukeboxes, yeah. They are boxes. It's like, what are they talking about boxes? They're jukeboxes. Okay, so these are good. So I'm gonna do these first. This order that I took them off makes no sense, but it's fine. So these are gonna get locked. Can I make copies at the same time? Lock and copy. No, you can't. Okay, so lock. Good. Lock it. Good. Lock it. Good. Lock it. Lock it. Um, so for anyone who doesn't know this, this is... If you put a piece of glass in a cartography table, a glass pane, and a map, it makes it locked so it doesn't update anymore uh, if you pick it up. It does still get that green pin on it, though, which is kind of annoying. I wish it didn't do that. Makes sense, but not really. Right, so now we're going to make copies. So I have three of each. So let's do this. Two more. What? They only made one copy. What's going on? Oh, that's weird. It doesn't... It's fine. It's fine. Why does it do that? I guess I don't need to do stacks then. How do I get four of that one? I'm so confused. Whatever. I feel like I don't have enough maps with me, actually. I may have to... Or maybe I do. I may have enough. But... Oh, it's duplicating. So if you put two in there, it makes... It makes two more. That's so... Sus. Okay, so we got 
three and four of a couple of them. So, I am running out of maps, actually. I'm gonna run out. I just need to do the center map. I just want to have extra copies. So this is a new map of the center. Good. Now let's lock it. Is it good? I should fly around, even though it's definitely fine. A little paranoid. We. Oh, my shulker boxes are on it. That is not good. I had to remove those. <laughs> Just punching with a map. It looks so funny. Why is that so funny? Okay, so this is the map now. All good. So now... Gosh, my inventory's so full. I could just go under here. I'm nervous about messing up the map. I think this would be fine. Oops. Okay, so put this map in here. Lock it. These are all locked, right? Okay, good. Now we make a duplicate. So I have one duplicate of that. Looks good. Yep. Beautiful. Alright, so now let's go put them up. Hype. Love that. Oh my god. With two hands. Why? <laughs> Why is that just so funny and silly? I love it. This game is so weird. I love Minecraft. Hey, do I have all my boxes? I don't want to lose anything, please. Uh, I can grab these item frames. I don't want to put any in the item frame by accident. That would be kind of awkward. Let's put them all in here in order. I did not do that in order at all. Why did I do that? Help. Help. Okay, so this is, I think, the bottom left. This is the bottom middle. This is the right side. This is the top middle. This is the top right left. This is the bottom right. That's the left side. This looks so cool. I love this. That's the middle and that's the top right. I think we did it right. Cool. Uh, let's grab the thingies. I forgot there's a wall behind this, actually. Yeah, so before we add any other fun details to this build, we just got the ink blot. Is there glass there? Good. Cool. I think, yeah, right by the elevator. I fix this. Two, three, four, five. Cool. And then to get to the elevator, we gotta do one of these. Uh, okay, good. Makes me nervous every time. I feel like I'm just gonna splat into the wall. Okay, so... Oh, it's gonna be kinda high up. I think it'll look fine, though. So I don't think- I, I can't get them side by side. Cause I can't center them. And it's also too wide. I could make it wider, but... I think it'll look fine stacked. Let's try it. I don't think I'll be able to reach. I need to make sure- wait a second. I think these are gonna get destroyed. Shit. 
Because anything above this... Actually... I'm not sure. Maybe it's three blocks. I may have to move it up one block. Because I think everything three blocks above this obsidian platform gets destroyed when you summon the dragon. I think it's three blocks of space. Maybe a little more. Eh, that's okay. Well, I'm not going to summon the dragon right now anyway. And if someone does, I have copies of the map. So it'll be fine. I did not bring scaffolding for some reason. Is that one more? All right, let's do the maps. Okay, um, this is great. We'll finish up here shortly, and then I can go make cookies and eat them. Very excited about that. Okay, so let's get rid of this. So I'm going to put the black map on the bottom since it's the current one. I'm a little nervous only having one copy. I should put a set somewhere so I don't lose anything. <laughs> like, like an off-site backup. <laughs> So if I ever lose that shulker box, they're just gone. I should probably make a, a better backup. Oops, I fell off the thingy. Can't ever see anything when we're in this angle. Okay. This. That. Whoa, look at the light on this map. This looks wild. The heck? I've never seen this kind of lighting effect before. Let's build a temporary stair so I can get back up if I fall again. Looks so interesting. And the marker is so funny over there on the right. It's so disorienting because I just always feel like this is the south and that's the north because you enter on this part. But no, you, you spawn in on the side of the island and then you run in. That's kind of disorienting because like the map would be that way. Should be rotated technically. Should we rotate the map? I think we should rotate it, right? So the marker's like... So it's actually looking north? I think that's actually better. That's how the maps look the most accurate. Alright, so we gotta take this off again. I should have done this like this, it's fine though. So, oh, I messed that totally up, whatever. All right, so the top right should be over here. Rotated once. Oh goodness, this is gonna be so confusing. This one should go here. Yep. Yep. This was the right side, now this is the bottom. Oops, not there. Is this going to make more markers on the map? I think it did. That's so annoying. Can I... I have an extra one of this. Goodbye. I'm going to throw it in the bubble elevator. Goodbye. Whee! Okay. Um, the right map, I need a copy. I have one copy left. It's fine. Why does this have a marker on it? What? I didn't put it down yet. That's not how that's supposed to work. It's locked, right? It is. Whatever, I'll deal with that later. Okay, um... This one was the center, it goes back in the center, because the center is always the center. And then we got what was the right becomes the top. Looks so weird, I think. What was the bottom right becomes the bottom left. 
bottom middle becomes the left middle, and then that one goes there. Ah, uh, that looks that looks so weird at this angle. Why does it look so weird? But that's like the way it's facing. How do you keep them all straight? You're confused. Like, um... Like, rotated? Or just, like, in order? Or, like, knowing where which one goes? Or... I don't really know exactly what you mean. Because I want to ans answer you for sure. So I'm like rotating it right now is what I'm doing. Is so you can rotate them in the item frame. <laughs> it does. Very round ghost with a swirly hair on top. Oh my god. So right now, like, the map's always, like, um, by default face north. Like, the top of the map is always north. So I'm putting them in the item frame. Since this is actually not north, we're facing, um, we're facing west. Which is where the entrance of the island is. Towards the middle of the island, we're facing west. So I'm rotating the map once to the right to, like, orient it. So, like, it's facing the direction we're looking. So now we're at the bottom and the center of the island is straight ahead. If that makes sense. Doc, we need a small pride festival in Bones SP. Yes. Summer festival. But the summer festival probably won't be till July. But it'll be built during Pride Month. We could do a small little Pride Festival too. I was just saying Um we need a new banner and shield like little booth. But I think instead of at the summer festival, we could set up a little one there too. We should have one in the city so it's like permanent. In like a spot. Um, so if someone ever wants to build that. I think it would be a fun project for someone to do. I, I would do it too, but if someone wants to do it. Yeah, the city, yeah. Yeah, I think just July, just so people have time to work on stuff. I plan on making a rainbow beacon that, like, rotates colors at the Summer Festival. Yeah. We could talk about it. We could do a little small festival too, but I think the one... It's like a nice continuation of the Pride Month, you know? <laughs> we build it during June and then like... We just keep that Pride going, you know? But if people want a separate one too, we could do that. I hadn't really thought about it too much. They're kind of like close together in time. Just a matter of like getting people... That if they want to go on and do it. Where should we do it? If we did a separate one, where would we where should we do it? Or should we just all do pride things? Up for any as long as there's pride, yeah. Yeah, I plan on doing something at the summer festival. I think it's a nice way, because also if it sticks around, too, it's, like, in that season, you know? <laughs> yeah. Definitely, Shawnees. <laughs> yeah. Wait, Shawnees, I, I saw you say, um... 
The one Ghost from Mario Universe. I feel like I know what you're talking about. I never played that one, but I feel like I know what you're talking about. Yeah. I'm I'm just so vibing. June is such a special month for me as well. That's really good. We love having special months. Okay, let's let's do this top map. Not my birth though. That's September. For some reason, the way you said that, I figured it was something else, which I love that for you. Oh, that's the wrong spot. So this is the top left corner, technically. Where's the little island? I can't see. Why is it down here? Oh, I'm going the wrong direction. All right. Oof. We're rotating maps. All right. So this one is the top right now. Okay, then this one should be here. This one goes here. No one there. But no. <laughs> That's the left set goes on top. The funny little hairdo. Center, turn it. That's the right, so this is now the bottom. Oops. Uh that's that one. No, it is not. In the Haunted Mansion game, I think so. Oh, wait, King Boo? I thought there's another creature in one of the Mario games, but I was just probably making that up in my mind. King Boo. Oh my gosh, yeah, it's King Boo. It looks so weird, like, rotated sideways, but... That's just because I've seen it a lot of times before. But it makes the most sense as a map, you know? Because it's facing the direction we're going. Where's my pickaxe? Oh my gosh, it's in the box. Oh, it scared me. Hey, whatever. I can always get another pickaxe, but... What do you think of the maps here? They look good right at the entrance. I feel like this one's going to get deleted, so I'll have to move it up one. There might be, I don't know, a bunch of America. That's fair. I think this bottom will get deleted. I'll move it later. It doesn't matter. This is just for the sake of seeing if we like it. I frame it and put it on my wall. It looks like cool art. Nice. And then once we finish, when I do more to this island, like all these little the plus signs are where the gateways are. We'll eventually unlock all the gateways because right now we only have two. This little plus sign. Um, we only have two. There's, I think like a dozen gateways that open up around the perimeter. Oh, is it between each pillar? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine gateways? I think there's more. Anyway, those open up when you kill the dragon, so you have to kill the dragon over and over again. Um, so those should be on the map, too, the final map. But we have this copy for now, which I think is sweet. Okay, I think that's it. I think that's it. Um, I'm gonna wrap up here. I'm gonna find someone to raid. Um, I think there's a bunch of people on, so it should be relatively easy. Let's go to our ending screen. Doot, doot. Um, go window mode. 
Lots of progress. Yeah, it went well. We got, um... I think actually, if I leave it in this funny mode... I hope it pauses when I do that. Can I tab out of this? What's the trick to tab out without going to the text menu? <laughs> uh... There's a trick to tab out. Or at least tab and go to text. Whatever. I'm just gonna do it this way. This is fine. Okay, let's see who's on. I know there's a bunch of people. I think. Oh. Wait. Can I follow this person? I got a new new person. I think I followed someone recently that's playing Minecraft. Yeah. W. I like follow people playing new people playing Minecraft and then they're never playing Minecraft when I'm ending playing Minecraft. <laughs> so this is cool. Yeah. Let's, let's go over here, I think. How did I find... How did I end up here? Alright. Just... Alright, let's go over here. Read. Melon Doodle. Thanks for hanging out, everyone. This has been fun. Got a lot done today. Uh, here is... Oh, credits. My credits aren't working. It's, oh, there they go. Let's see if they're from today's stream or not. <laughs> I feel like they've been acting really weird. And here's the raid commands. If you're subbed. That looks accurate to today. One troll follow, one real follow. Thank you. And a raid from August and pocket leaves. Those numbers are pretty fucked up. The numbers are over the names. That's kind of hilarious. Yeah, thanks for hanging out, everyone. This has been really nice. Um, got a lot done. I'll be back tomorrow. We're going to play Near Replicant. On a Wednesday night. Let's go. That should be fun. And try to get through that game. I don't think we'll finish it tomorrow, but... We're getting through it, so... That's cool. Let me copy one of my read messages as well. If you're not subbed, the skull emojis. If you are subbed, the little running dude. And I'll see you then. Um, if I work on this project again next week on Minecraft, I don't know what we'll do. So I had to think about that. Yeah, that's it. Bye. Good night. I'm sending you over now. Peace.